outcast who became a warrior, who faced her demons and challenged the gods for her lover's soul, has accepted the voices, the furies, as part of herself. Just like her mother, Galena, she was not like other people. She saw and heard the world differently. Her father, Zinbel, told her she was evil, tainted by the sin of her mother. Tormented and afraid, she retreated from the world. of her father stayed with her, reminding her of her curse. And when the plague came to her land, the people blamed Senua. She took her darkness with her, banishing herself to the wilds. So she was not there when the Northmen massacred her people and sacrificed Dillian to the god of hell. Senua's torment was so deep that the world around her fell away. She took the head of her beloved, the vessel of his soul, and vowed to go to hell herself to save him. Through mist-shrouded horrors, she fought to find the secret path that would lead her to the very gates of hell. But the way was marked by fire and illusion. Senua had to fight the gods that guarded these paths and stave off the rot which threatened to consume her mind and end her life. Only conquest could open the gates. Only blood would bring her face to face with Hela. Face to face with defeat. Once again, Senua was engulfed in darkness, lost in a maze of misery and confusion, until Dillian's voice led her to the promise of victory, a sword that could kill a god. To win the sword, Senua would drown in her darkest memories, pulling at the shards lodged in flesh, mind and soul. She pressed deeper into the underworld, resisting its grasping hands and deafening cries, until she found her prize before the guardian of Hell's gates. Senua released her rage, a fury that could not be stopped, not by savage jaws, not by waves of warriors, not by the pull of death itself. In defeat and desperation, Senua begged for her beloved's release. But a sacrifice must be made, and burdens cast away. Senua's fate was never in the hands of the gods, but in her own. Out of love, to live, to go on, and to take us with her. Well, that was a pretty lengthy recap. Not bad. No, I like to show you the controls again, even though they've already showed them, like, when you started getting to the options. Oh, pretty. It's been a long time. She made a promise. 
was for the one she loved, dead now, but no less, a promise. Not one soul more would suffer as he had. She carries him in her heart. His death, his life, will drive her on. She will forge a purpose from his death. She's free now. It begins as it ends. Alone in the dark. So what happened? She got knocked the fuck out or what? Voices in her head are back. So, is this some rando that's a prisoner with you, or one of the guys that were on the ship that were running it? I know getting stranded out to sea worth nothing in sight would definitely suck ass. Alright, so now we are in control of Senua. What's with the letterbox though? Is that just how the game is set to be played?
I mean, I'm not complaining, but I just thought, I think it's just kind of odd that there's a letter box. Unless it's because it's probably still because this the intro stuff still. That up there. She's so far from home, from all she's ever known. Half drowned. Is he an assassin? Lost he looks like one. While still clouded to her eyes, which she won't yield. She must fight on, as she always has. Oh, he's gone now. Remember, Where'd you go, Mister? 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 I really love how this game looks. Definitely a lot smoother and I guess more more better optimized than how the first one was. I mean the first one was actually pretty good too. But it seems like this one is optimized a lot better. It actually plays a lot smoother even with everything maxed out and stuff. Climb, damn it! Don't fall now. Clive Wood. This is why I like games like this, and this is why I like the the new Tomb Raider, the modern Tomb Raider games. I mean, I've only played a little bit of the first one. I actually have the anniversary edition that I'm playing right now on the side, but that's one thing I do like about the modern Tomb Raider games is that, you know, you've seen like these characters like struggling so hard, especially when they're being beat to shit, but they keep pushing on and they go through so much shit, but they still manage to go through to um, complete whatever it is that they're looking for or, or whatever task they need to do. I'm not sure if I'm still controlling Senua or if this is all... Okay, I'm assuming I'm still controlling her. She's just not doing anything. Okay, there we go. She cannot falter. The voices draw her onward. Chippo Chow. Once she didn't live, once she could not save, she can hear them. With her. Come on, you're almost there. Then you can take a little break and breathe sweet relief. Okay, I don't think I'm controlling her now. Not sure. Oh. With fear, but she won't stop. Stronger forces drive her on. 
the narration then. Okay. Uh, what the hell was I saying? Oh, I'm not sure if this game has, like, collectibles or if it's got, like, um, shards or stones you gotta listen to, like, in the first one. But I'm pretty sure there's gonna be... If it's exactly the same like the first one, that'd be great. But I'm pretty sure just, like, all developers, they always like to change up things a little bit, which isn't... Which isn't bad, as long as it works. Not where, like, they completely change it and just fucks up everything like they do a lot of these games, like, lately. Okay. Okay, so we can run. I was pushing the wrong button. What's there? Is there anything around over here? Nope, nothing there. So we can't go over there, and obviously can't go over there. So let's go ahead and run. Oh, that's, uh... That was pretty interesting that I caught last minute. Or last second, I should say. Kind of looked like a person in the sky. Or like a shadow in the sky or something, whatever. That always happens in movies and stuff like that. You tell people who are afraid of heights, don't look down. What's the first thing that they do? They look down. like an before I go that way is there like a slight open world concept or is it pretty much going to be straightforward okay yeah it looks that looks like it's the only way almost sounds like I hear like loud thumping in the distance like there's something nearby ah here we go Yes, we do. Alright, so obviously the same voice actor who voiced Truth is in this, but it sounds like the, the dark voice is uh, a little bit different from the original. So I'm not sure if they couldn't get the same person again, or they just got someone else, or if it is the same person, but he just changed up his voice a little bit, because it definitely doesn't sound the same like before. So are we actually fighting with actual people now instead of like uh, demons and stuff? I mean, I'm pretty sure we're going to come across those same type uh, characters like in the first one, but this is pretty cool that we're fighting against actual uh, 
actual living pe people now. Oh, so we're gonna stealth kill him? Oh, never mind. Alright, so I'm assuming that was supposed to happen, whether we ran up here earlier or not. Motherfucker didn't drop his sword, at least. I obviously went down with him, but I was trying to be sarcastic. Alright, let's see what's around. Anything of interest around here? Oh yeah, this is definitely nice and smooth, like no no lagging or anything. So this is definitely optimized really well. Remember why we came here. She came here for the reason. What's up, Solus? Listen to us. You know better. Find the survivor. He is trying to trick you. We need to help the survivors. I was gonna say something after the voices were done, but I, now I forgot. <laughs> Must have been that. Oh, now I know what I was gonna say. I'm actually surprised for setting this up at 4K max settings that the uh, video data usage isn't that high. I was expecting to be a little bit more. Like I think it was only like at six or eight gigs used. But I know the DLSS feature that the NVIDIA cards have is supposed to kind of help improve the quality with um, with while utilizing less um, video graphics. Memory, but I still figure it'd be kind of high. All right. Let's see. Is there anything? A liar. Yep. Uh, hey, I respect that, man. Do your thing. Make mo make yourself some virtual money. All right, so I don't think there's anything of interest. Oh, is this where they fell on died? Oh, so that was a chick that wrestled that guy down. Ugh. Starting to get a little hungry, but I can wait. Oh, I guess there's no more stones to listen to around here. Huh? I won't be surprised if there's something around hidden in these rock areas. That's why I'm kind of doing a little bit of exploring. Alright, so that's obviously the way, but is there anything around? Nope. I think every time when we make virtual money, we wish it was real money. Hell, I'm pretty sure we even wish Monopoly money was real. <laughs> uh, let's see what's over here. Okay, so it all leads the same way, it looks like. Reminds me of this one episode of. Oh, hold on. 
fuck's going on? Why is shit floating? That's not normal. Is the apocalypse happening or something? What the hell? Is that like some kind of giant peacock or something coming out of the ground? What the fuck is this shit? What's happening? You know that's it. Focus. Focus. Don't let it block you. Focus. Do it. Focus. They are suffering. But I set them free. Simple. We need to find it. It's here. Somewhere. Look for it. Look for the sign. Okay, so we're back to the symbol stuff. Aha, I'm pretty sure I know what we gotta do now. Uh, interesting new way now. I mean, same concept, but I thought that was kind of interesting with that instead of it just being a regular door locked doorway. Finds the survivors. Hmm. A lot of walking. I know the last game was a lot of walking too, but it seems like there's a lot of walking from the very start in this one. I'm sorry, it was either you or me, and I chose me. I have to live. Even if that means sacrificing a few innocent bodies. I'm trying to help. I don't know how much I could do. I got my own problems to deal with, like the voices in my head who won't shut the fuck up. Okay. Gouge his eye out. Oh, shit. Well, that was smart. Coincidentally, his sword happened to be right in the perfect spot for her to grab it and shank his ass. Alright, so now we have a weapon, which means combat's gonna be coming, ha gonna be happening soon. Who wants to fight? Oh, am I too weak to, uh... I guess I'm too weakened to actually... 
kick his ass like I usually do. I don't mean kick his ass by being an ass. I meant like running and doing a melee attack like I normally do in these and the uh, and like in the, in the first one. Yeah, you bleed out and die, prick. I just explain how he just stand there like, yeah, go fight me. I'm gonna stand here and take your hits. Nope, never mind. Alright, so I'm guessing these guys are technically easy for a reason because it seems like they're not doing much except just standing there taking my hits or. Hey, don't blame me. I don't even know where the. Okay, now I know where I'm going. Or know where I'm supposed to be going, that is. I mean, it's not like I can save for everyone all at once. Shit. Funny how the first time I deflected is uh, I tried to deflect this attack, nothing happened. And then when I dodge, I still get hit. That made no sense. Funny how the voices in your head help you, but then they also talk shit to you at the same time. What a bunch of assholes. I'm guessing I'm supposed to back out now. Or... Oh, never mind. I was supposed to push A. That would make sense, I guess. Pushing that out of the way. Now the dead bodies come back. Or show up, I say. Dead body out of the way. Sorry, sir. I need to move you. Move. Thank you.
Some of this shit I can't tell if it's a, if it's an actual cutscene or if I'm supposed to do something. I'm guessing I'm supposed to push A. Oh, there we go. More combat or what? Never mind, I guess she just has her sword out. Fuck you too, asshole. I'm not out here just trying to defend myself. Fucker, get stabbed. What is dark rot coming back or something? All right, let's see where. I think it's this way. Oh, what the hell? Figment of your imagination. You, slave, come here. What are you going to do with that sword? Weapon wielder. Look, man, we know you're badass, all right? Break his fucking nose! This 
Come on, get angry. Damn, you punched the shit out of me. But I don't wanna. I'm not going down that easy, motherfucker. Come on, just fucking end it already. Come on, Senor, he's fucking you up. Beat him senseless. Smack his head with a rock. At least smash the side of his face. You don't have to actually smash him in the head. What is he got the darkness or plague inside him now or something? And then all of a sudden it's daylight. sign. What is it? You need to understand. You need to understand. Answer! It is my father's sigil. His father. Your father. Huh? The Gothi. Monster. He's here. <laughs> Look at him. No. But this place is his. The people here are weak. They would not survive without his help. You like you. Does she? Enough! He's wounded. He won't try anything. You have to keep your eyes on him. Hmm. 
so what? Now we gotta trail this guy and stop him if he tries to run away or something? Still don't know why they designed the game to have like a little letterbox type setting. As I said, you, know, you tell him how it is. You need to find them. Move quickly. Don't let this punk ass bitch tell you what to do. I will take you to my people, like I said. But not into this settlement. You have no idea what you're walking into. He wants you to I just turn around. All right, nothing like babysitting Uncle Gimpy over here. He wouldn't understand. I can't. Damn you! Why won't you listen to reason? I thought your father protected these people. He does. Indeed. You can't protect people from their own stupidity. It looks like they let their guard down. They brought this on themselves. East Troika. What are they? What is this evil? He understands that we do not. I know a lot of people aren't really big on the whole HDR thing, but I love it. Especially when, like, the brightness and, like, how the shadows look and all that stuff.
need to find out what it is. They are. They are. They're dead. You're mad. She's not he mad. Doesn't <gasps> see the signs. So he makes sense. Stupid. He doesn't. You're mad. He doesn't know. He doesn't see the signs. There is no way. I am going in there. Look at him. Just tie him up to a that him. thing back there. Wounded. I was gonna say tree, but there's no trees around. Defeated. Or nearby, I'd say. But you need him. No. He will try to escape. She has. Go on then. Do it. Don't let the rage get the better of you. The rage. The rage is coming. That's something that the Draeger doesn't get you. You'll need to stay alive. You must discover what's happening. That evil is here. All right, let's see what kind of trouble we can get into in this area. What happened here? What happened here? Everybody has I smell a massacre. Dead bodies everywhere. It's happening again. Hey, this that's a song by Corn. Dead bodies everywhere. Do you remember? Do you? Bodies everywhere. It's too much. Who did this and I'm going to assume this game is probably focused more heavily on uh, story. Look away. Why? But I want to look at it. I'm crazy like that, yo. Anybody home? Hello? much screaming and horror all over the place. I'm assuming we're supposed to go up, but before we go up, let's uh, see what's around here. Uh, 
that door. Okay, it's closed. Or locked, I should say. Leave it the way around. So many dead. Don't look at it. Right, let's see. It's happening again. It's him. Okay. Before we do that, let's go around over here. See if there's any stuff around of interest. Now let's go up here. Climb up here and see what's going on. Oh, looks like we got to focus on some shit. Or is that happening because of the thing I just looked at? We just came across. Hmm, okay, maybe not yet. All right, so let's go over here now. Before we go to that. Something tells me that we probably gotta go to that first before we could do anything else, but I'm just gonna look around just to be on the safe side. Now let's go back over here really quick. And go up here. Let's see what's in here before we... Oh, so that's for that. Oh, never mind. I thought you were going to lift the board you were going to lift up or something. This is going to take us. You can never forget that memory lives. If you face it, the past will free you. So it's like a barrier or something that just all of a sudden appeared. Alright, let's go down. Alright, I guess we have no choice but to go there now. Because I don't think we can go up this path. Or, I wouldn't really call it a path, but. Alright, let's go. Custerary voice. Or a custer arrow, but I like pronounce that, whatever. I probably gotta go in here. Are the symbols I'm looking for. You need to find another she needs to find Oh wait. Now I knew we gotta go up. So 
It looks like the voice is a little bit more vocal when it comes to finding these finding these memor uh, these uh focus items than they were in the first one. I mean yeah, I mean they were vocal in the first one, but it seems like they're a lot more vocal in this one. Beyond this pathway. What are you doing? Return to the gates. Use you understand. It. Use it. You will never understand. Where are we now? Where are you? What's that? Oh, you recognize this place? No. Zenwa, it's home. Can you hear it? She's singing. Galena is here. Do you remember that song? Mommy! You've come home! It's your mother. So come in. Can you hear her? It's Galina. She's singing. It wasn't all bad, was it? I know you're off at 6.30 and how are you going? How's work going so far? I have forgotten about you. I do pay attention to the time, unlike there you. Was happiness too. She sang to you. You need to hold on to that. You need to remember that. It will help you. Is the store still busy? Do they have the AC cranked up high in the front? Seems like these guys throw all combos now. Fuck that metal man up. Even our heavy attacks are faster in focus mode. All right, now it looks like we're going back to reality, I think. I guess we're still in the past then. You've already seen this. He's not suffering anymore. Nope, oh, there's our boy strung up again. Her father, Simba. Oh, is that her dad? You could escape your past, Senua. You tried to run, didn't you? She can't forget. 
You can never forget. You thought you got away. No. You thought you left it behind in hell. Dillian. Dillian, you're Dillian. You. Lovely Dillian. Him. Him. But you will never be free of this. His pain. His suffering. However far you go, it will hold you forever in darkness. It's the only way. Take your darkness with you. It's yours. You may now pass. The worst pain, the cruelest blows, they make us who we are. Do you see that? She does. She won't lose them again, her mother, her lover. She won't forget. She won't let them slip from her. Like light fading as eyes close. She will hold them. She's looking at something. Hmm. All right. Now it's getting dark again. Before we go in there, see if there's anything around. Wow, this is really nice. All right, so no totem holes to listen to this time, or yet. in my every movement like in a whole actual horror movie okay let's see what's up here really quick before we go outside nothing unless uh, I there must be there's no point or maybe we need to come up here at a later time or something else. I just saw auto safety thing down below. Alright, what's around here? Nothing. Alright, let's see where else we can go. Anything of interest in this little shack? Nothing, nothing, nothing. <clears throat> Alright, so... I'm assuming we have to go down that way before we do that. Before we do that, let's see... Is 
there's anything of interest around over here in these areas. Oh, okay. I guess she doesn't. She's not gonna walk on that. Alrighty. I guess we do have to go straight then. Watch this little bridge collapse underneath us. This is really nice. I like the way how the moon looks. That voice, something dark somewhere. You need to go up there. Don't let them see you coming. You need to find out. Don't let the monsters find you. You can do this. We believe in you. We believe in you. That did you say? What it's like to fear. Interesting coloring. It's getting dark. It's easy to turn back, turn away, when every nerve is screaming with fear. Be safe, be quiet, run and hide, run away. But to turn back is to lose yourself, lose your way, defeated and dead-eyed. And the path ahead is clear, soaked in blood and bile, but beacon bright. Clear. All right. Not sure what the fuck those things are, but they must be like cursed or something. The Traeger. Where 
we're gonna be nosy and see what's going on. I journey to these darkest lands to heal those overcome by fear and hate. However dark it seemed, I always found a ray of light. And in this wretched land, by far the darkest of them all, it seemed the shadow would never lift. But I knew I would find my light. Who is he? He knows her. He feels us. Reaching to us in the dark. You have to help him, Senwa. This is our quest. This is our destiny. Senwa, how would you give your life for these outsiders? In my darkest hour, it was an outsider who saved me. This man, his kin killed yours. You should want his blood, not to give him aid. Oh, you have lost your way. Moving on now. All right, people are getting slaughtered. That's right, fight back. But of course, you failed. You tried to fight back, but you failed there, sir. What are they doing to her? Dragging her away? Taking her? No, don't fight back. Look what they do to those who fight. They want to go to you, see you. They will destroy you limb from limb. Don't let them see you yet. It's not time. You have to get out. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. Get out. It's not too late to die. Too late to turn back now, we've gone too far. It sounds so horrific. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go up here or if up here is something else I can listen to. Or it's another way around. Let's see. I'm guessing it's another way around or it's just another way to look. Let's see. I'm guessing another way around because I could have gone. Ah, here we go. Oh, never mind. Here we go. Hidden thing to listen to. The scalds tell how the revenant glamour roamed the settlements, terrifying all those who lived there. Each one he killed, in turn, rose to walk beside him. Thus, evil begets evil. But the man Gretir was proud and overbearing. And thought the Droiger no match for his strength. Okay, so I'm not sure if these are random or if I missed two already. No, my luck, I probably missed two already. Alright, now we gotta go down. Since we're still trying to get by this area. Yeah. All right, 
make your way through there, Senua. And let's see what happens. Something tells me that we're probably gonna get caught. Just like in every type of horror game. Sun drain, okay. You could have just left to the fact that the sun just kicked your ass and I would have understood still. Somebody was slaughtered. You will never understand this power. Something is coming. Something's coming, all right. I want to watch him get slaughtered. Okay. Guess that's it. Can't look up and see someone getting slaughtered? Oh well. No, oh, yep, nothing like getting a face full of blood while you're trying to crawl through. Hopefully he doesn't have the AIDS. Uh, all right, I guess we'll just keep moving like you voices are telling me to. Like, you want to help me, but at the same time, you guys want to talk shit at the same time. These guys can't fight for shit. So I see these guys have combo attacks. Fuck you, bitch. So I wonder if they have the perfect block mechanic in this because... People trying. Oh shit. Ow. Ow. Anyways, like I was trying to say, I wonder if they have the perfect lock mechanic because it seems like whenever. Oh shit. But then again, I guess you could say the uh, other one kind of had like a perfect block mechanic too. Ow.
motherfucker. Anyways, what I was trying to say, the original one did kind of have like a perfect block mechanic, so you have to just time your block right, which... But it seems like it... But it seems like that doesn't happen here. Fuck him up, Senua! Oh shit, I'm supposed to block that. Damn it. No, 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 no. Really? Fuck you, motherfucker. Now, where's the other asshole? Oh, never mind. I guess that was it. Because I thought the, uh, happened to the fire guy that, that killed me. Time for that? I've been waiting for you. She is coming. Can you feel her? She can feel it. Something from the other world. So much for getting excited that whatever you're summoning killed you. And then it's daylight again. Save now. Let's go. Uh, all right. It's all gone. All those monsters are dead. And the people. Did you see it? Il Toiga. Il Toiga. Il Toiga. Wonder what she looks like. Or, well, she obviously kept because I keep saying she. Fall into the dryer and to something else. I went into a mask. What was that? And they took me as well. But he was not like Why the were others. you bound to that pole? What were the Draga doing? I'm calling to the creature, drawing her forth with her. thunder the and God. called through death. And I was an offering. But why? Why were they calling it? It killed them. Are we safe now? I seem to worship her. He seems too calm. What is she? Dark heart seems to speak to their own. I mean, all the old gods have left these lands, so we should leave as well. Well, we'll find you once where we can. 
this land is cursed, Senua, we will only find death. Everyone is dying, and you know they will blame you. Everyone does. We do. What are you going to do? What can we do? Follow him. Okay, not bad. That was something of interest, but I guess not. I mean, she's looking at it. Or she was, I should say. <clears throat> Alright, whatever. <clears throat> Alright, there you guy. Where are we going? This is really nice. Senua looks a little bit hotter in this in the, this one than in the first one. Just can't go there. Ah, there you go. More listening. Okay, assuming if they're going in order as I approach them, I'm guessing I did miss two of them already. Oh, that sucks, but whatever. It is what it is. Alright there, mystery man. Let's keep going. Done talking, or are you still gonna talk to me there, guy? You're from Orkner by your accents. How did you come here? As a slave. I have the slave master tied down there. He brought you here. Your master. Maybe he escaped. We don't know his name. We do now. I didn't ask his name. Forkister of Borkarirki. We need to go there. He knows. He knows. You know it? Can you tell me how to get there? Yes, but why would you want to go there? I'll kill you. Worse. You need to go there, Senwa. Don't doubt. Don't be a coward. He can help you. He will show you the way. You don't need that monster. What was the name? Thorgaster. By the gods. Oh, what a terrible thing this is. The Draga were always savage. This is worse than I ever thought possible. I believed that with time, we could claw back our land. He wished that, but he didn't believe it. He has no hope. Well, this gets darker, bloodier with each day that passes. Yep. Oh, 
Here we go. Let's see if our boy is still tied down or not. That monster Lorgester is still there. Still alive. What are you going to do, Senua? You know what to do. We don't need him anymore. And what do you want to do about him? Nothing. Leave him. I don't need him. You can tell me where I need to go. He cares about him. But if you leave him, he will die. So? Or simply starvation. Don't doubt, Senua. If the Droiga took him, it would be no less than he deserves. Help me. She is weak. Don't feel pity. He doesn't deserve it. She cannot do it. Something about him. She saw it. Not just a monster. She saw it. A ray of light. He is evil. There is no choice. So stupid. He's not listening to us. A wound looks bad, Folgister. But if you accept my hospitality, I can have it treated. You will not make it far alone. I will come with you. But this changes nothing. Do not expect any gratitude from me or my father. How could I? You still haven't told me what she is. It's so many questions. She's giant. They awaken at sundown. Man, she should have just let this ass to die. Many have tried to fight them, but all have failed. They're immortal. Maybe the gods can kill them, but there are no gods in these lands. The giants they hide by day and hunt at night. Now you may think, well, at least there's some respite by day. But know this, the nights grow longer, come winter, there is no day, just an endless night. Soon the time of man will end. and misery across the sea. For some time you were happy. Like us. We were happy. Until you. And then the volcano and the darkness came. The monster started enslaving people. Each tiger stalks my settlement when night falls. It tramples our crops and kills what little livestock we've left. We're starving. Why don't you leave? <laughs> I've tried. They failed. No matter how far we get by day, as night falls, she hunts us down. And there's children here. People too weak to run. We're trapped. Night on night, our numbers fall. He is asking you to help. No, he isn't. They need you. They are dead if they don't fight back. So we can free roam a little bit. Let's, so let's see if there's anything of interest to listen to. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything this way. Oh wait, there's a head. Not sure if Brian caught that when he did his playthrough. Say the winds are trapped inside the earth. They try always to make their escape, and they buffet and beat on the walls of their prison, causing the earth to quiver. And when they break through, they make their escape. They explode out in fury. Okay. So I guess no talking faces this time, like in the first one. All right, let's move it on out. Let's see if there's anything else. Kind of smells like soup in here. Oh. 
dead cow. Nothing in there. So they're over there waiting. Anything else around here? Because we could do a little bit of exploring. They're just hanging out waiting. Nothing there. Not safe here. He said we would have refuge. Yeah, well, unfortunately, just because you're given refuge doesn't mean Look, that's gonna be the best thing for you. Cracks in the ground. The land is broken. Made there. I think that's where we the came from. They hunt at night. The sun. It's going down. She's coming. The light is fading. Yep, so something tells me that shit's gonna go down once we get um, closer to the village. Alright. Okay, let's go catch up to these guys. That sunset looks nice. Too bad there wasn't an option where you can fuck with this guy and kick his leg or something. She can see the threat that binds the world. Can feel its hidden pulse. And knows when that pulse quickens. She feels it now. A tremor on her skin. A being taking shape. Something is coming. Run to the hills. Run for your lives. All right. Better stop before I get a copyright strike. All right, so I take it now. We're just running. Running, 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 running. Stop shaking, let's stop. She will take you. 
Yep. Keep running. You better run, Senua. Just like a woman, always falling. Just like that Friday the 13th theme with Jason. There's no need to run. Shield is trip. Bitches always be tripping. Yep, what's going on now? Is this like a mini boss fight or something? That's a huge bitch! That's a crazy looking bitch. Volcano erupted. It tore open the wall between this world and yours tonight. The giants came flooding from the east, killing and eating whomever they could lay their hands on. And now some of us, we hide. You have to fight, not hide. Make defenses, struggle on. And some of us use others to stem the tide. Others? What do you mean? Tell her, tell her, Tolgestur. Tell me, tell me. Shall I tell her what your father's been doing? What else is there to do, Fagrimmer? We found a way to keep our people safe. He is part of it too. He believes. Your people are dying. There is no other way. Tell us, tell us. What are they doing? The Gorde of Borkervirki is using slaves. Slaves from your lands. Sacrifices. Sacrifice. He's offering them to the giants so that his people will be left alone. This stops now. He's a monster. You can't stand alone against us. You have no eyes. He does not see, but he can see. His darkness is evil. We can show him. He's a monster. There is Senor. another way. There is always another way. Tell you how you mark now. If you try to leave the Red Hills, he will hunt and kill you. No. Then I will kill her first. She, she can't be killed. It's impossible. I have killed a god, Fagrima. Nothing is impossible. No, there is no way. He is right. We cannot kill the giant. The gods cannot be killed. You can't. You deserve this. Why did you come here, Senua? To stop the slavers. You thought you were helping them. Stranded. 
will kill the giant. Not sure if anyone agrees with me, but I've already said it in my first stream when I play this, but Senyo looks pretty fucking hot in this one compared to the first one. Not sure if it's because of the makeup or just because they made her face look like she had, like, um, cracking in her skin or something. Well, you know, just like that age-old expression there, uh, terrible. Crazy in the head means crazy in the bed, right? <clears throat> Actually, let me close these blinds really quick so I'm not getting no reflection on my TV. There we go. Not too bad, but that light reflection was kind of uh, bothering me a little bit. All right, here we go. A light to banish the darkness. Okay, so I'm guessing we're gonna be doing things like in the first one where we have to stay in the light or use the light to help us out in some situations. Well, at least this time, she actually doesn't sit down and drop. She just actually kind of kneels down and then drops, so... And let me see, are we supposed to go back this way where we came, or... I'm assuming we just take the light towards this, and it'll open the, the way, probably. Okay, there we go. It is not so easy to banish me, child. You can't beat me down anymore. All right, so we got one, two, three paths we got to go through. My path is the only path. You can't hurt me. You can't keep me trapped. Okay, so not sure if I died or if that was supposed to happen. Let me see. Um, let me see. I'm guessing that was probably supposed to happen. I don't know. Well, let's go this way real quick. Okay. Okay, so may okay. I guess maybe I did die then. So I'm guessing we're supposed to just pick the right path, and then we're supposed to turn away when that shit turns red or something. I don't know. All right, so let's uh, try it this way. That, or it's almost like... Ah! <laughs> 
combat, and this one is a tad bit different from the first one. Because it seems like, hey, I got a new follower. Hold on. Thank you, Hazel Watson. How are you doing? Thank you for the follow. Spilling blood fill the skies with smoke. The torch. You can't do anything without your torch. Trapped here now forever. Think. Anyways, I'm uh I'm not too bad, you know, just once I recover, it's not like I got an ask. Agony sets us free. I wouldn't uh, say I'm recovering from an ass-kicking version of COVID. This one's actually not that bad. I think the Delta variant's the worst one that I've had. And assuming you're not trying to advertise anything, I greatly thank you for the follow. But if that's what you're trying to do eventually, then I'm just giving you the heads up. Just like everyone else in my family member to say the same thing. You know, uh, we're, we're not about that. We will. We already have someone in mind that does our art and stuff for us. Submit to me, or you will die here. I won't let you stop me. All right, so I'm guessing we just gotta stay out of the path that has the red light. Really, dear Emmy? You think you got it pretty bad? You will never be free, never safe, unless you heed my words. You can't hurt me. You must have a weaker uh, immune system then. But then again, Patrick's also down too. Not sure if he's actually napping. I think I heard snoring, so. But I'm. But I'm pretty sure. But I'm pretty sure in his case, it's just boredom. All right, so now we have to do a little cat and mouse where we have to stay in the light or what? There's another torch. There is always a way. Ow. Ow. Get up, bitch! Up there, my that. There goes the three strikes. I was waiting for that one. Seems like she gets her focus a little bit faster than this. Oh shit. Damn it. What the hell was that? That was a weird. Oh, what the hell? Get your ass up. Oh, you can use your focus when you're down too? I didn't know that. I accidentally button mashed that one. Anyways, what I was trying to say earlier is this, not sure if I died earlier, but this seems like it's kind of like um, that one area in Devil May Cry 4, where if you don't follow the light and choose the wrong path, you have to start over. 
You will never oh. find your way to this night. Not that way. Alright, so let's go ahead this way. Oh yeah, Crystal's trying not to die in Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I saw her log into it earlier when I was going down to get some water. <laughs> it's time to give up, child. Leave this land. No. What you did to me, I see it here. They are cowed like I was. Lost like I was. Believing what they're told. Sacrifices. Spilling blood for a lie. I speak the truth. Okay, so oh wait, are we supposed to like light these up or something? Okay, unless there's something else we're supposed to do. Was there something that I missed? Hmm. Okay. Is there like some kind of puzzle I'm supposed to solve, or what's going on here? Oh wait, hold on. There it is. We must cleanse our sins with sacrifice. It is the way of the gods. Your mother sin and will sacrifice. Until you came back, bringing sin with you. The gods cannot be killed. All we can do is placate them. Slake the thirst with blood and fire. I see through your darkness now. I see through your lies. And I will show them how to see as I do. I will not appease your gods. I will destroy them. Tried to hold you down in the darkness. Darkness. Told you there was no way out. That the gods ruled you. But you fought back. You were strong. Maybe you could fight back now. She can fight back. She can. Maybe there is a way to pull through. There is always a way to pull through. Darkness. Darkness. To kill the giant. She will find a way. She is strong. You will hurt her. She is stronger than this. You can kill the gods. She knows the truth. She sees it now. Tell her. You are wrong, Fagrimer. The giants, they can be killed. <laughs> there is a way. Well, I'm not sure I believe that. But I think if anyone can find a way, it's you. He knows we are special. Before, when I rescued you, he understood. You said you were waiting for me. He felt us coming. But I'd never met you. How can he see inside? Well, I knew someone would come. Somebody different. You are different. Somebody with the ability to look at the world and see what might be. You are special. Not what is. She's not special. And that is you. She's just like the others. No. She I've seen special. you listening to the voices that we cannot hear. To the Varadir and Gandir. Voices have to see them without us. You have the ability to see behind the veil. You are a Seth Connor, a seer, whether you know it yet or not. A seer? What is this he speaks of? Do you know, Senwa? Do you know this is you? Your Toiga. Where does she go when the sun is up? She brings suffering to everyone. 
the monster. She hides down there. Hiding. Waiting. Under the cover of the cliff. She's there most days. Just staying close. Waiting for us to slip. Constant fear. They are waiting but you cannot die. approach you down there in the shadows. You don't stand a chance. And she won't come out until it's night. You have to do something. This is why you have been called here, Senua. They shouldn't live in fear. He knows. Listen to him. Have you heard of the Hidden Folk? Hidden Folk? The Hidden Folk? Yeah. Have you heard of them? A secret people. Powerful, aloof. Once they were gods or something like, but now they hide themselves in the earth. Even the giants steer clear. The giants fear them. If the giants fear them, they must hold the key to their they fate. Hold the secret. Will they help us? Well, they have no love for man. And whatever ties we have are weaved from heartbreak and despair. Although I did consume their bitter bread yes, just once. So it is. And they did grant me what I sought. If he can find them, you can find <laughs> They will. They will test you. We have been tested they might even before. try to kill you. But if you win their favor, we might die. They might give you what you seek. Where can I find them? They will give us what we seek. There's a rock. Close to here, where they are said to live. Its entrance is hidden. You might find it. She will find it. They want you to? You will. I will find it. We might die down there. No. We could die trying to find them. They will give us what we seek. They are dangerous. But they will help us. We will make them. Make them. They Man. know things. So much dialogue in this game. I try not to want to talk they talk in between it. So uh so Desiree hasn't gotten sick yet either, Jeremy. Is that what you're saying? They will show you how to end the giants. They will save you. Be careful. No more sacrifices. Be careful, sacrifice stops. And then, <laughs> not sure if uh, Patrick has already told you. I know he told me it yesterday. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say this on Twitch, so not trying to get people confused with Resident Evil 2, but we'll just say... We'll just say that we caught the G virus since it seemed like only all the men got sick and not the women. <laughs> okay, so I guess maybe you can since uh, Souls just said it on the ta on the chat. All right. <clears throat> Okay, at least, at least in this one, like I said, I like how she actually kneels down to jump instead of like the first one where she actually sits down and falls off. That to me made no damn sense. Which I still don't get why she had to do that just to climb a ladder. It's like, why can't you just turn around, crouch down, and step, step one foot at a time while climbing down the ladder? It's like, why you gotta sit down? I mean, come on, you're supposed to be a warrior, you're not a dainty little fairy or at least act like a hardened woman on uh, even for like the simple stuff <sighs> let's see she has been chosen all the lost ones only she can save them all the people here dying in this nightmare only she can set them free. And she's running out of time. Every day that dies, every sun that sets, another loses their life. Night fading from their eyes and name cast away in the wind. And soon the sun will set for good. Hmm. 
When you say you're recording audio there, Terrible, does that mean you're recording audio for like the bits you want to use during your review or something else? hell is this thing? Okay. Okay, so I guess she can't hoist herself up. Okay, is this supposed to uh, reveal or show us something? Or let's go this way. Oh, okay. Uh, All right, looks like a trial or something. Up. Okay, so are we supposed to focus on it or? Okay, so I guess we weren't just supposed to focus on it. <clears throat> That was, uh, interesting. The offering. Dead. Bodies. Bodies everywhere. Dead bodies everywhere. Now we go back to reality. But there will be more. There's always more. Well done, Senna. She is strong enough. You will not die like the others before. You will survive this. Parker, then. He could see her, see what she really is. He knows about us. He can hear us as well. So there's a totem up there, but again, she can't climb up, so there has to be a route up to there. I think I already missed, I think, like, two or three of them already, because I'm not sure if they illuminate in order, in a, obviously in a sequence, so I'm assuming the ones that haven't illuminated I've already missed, somehow. Let me see. The imaginary friend in imaginary is like Cell or Frieza. It has three forms, all of which are dumb. Oh, so it's not just about a teddy bear? That was sarcasm, by the way. Armed only with the knives and axes they had brought to cut out the whale, even picking out the whale ribs to beat down their enemies. Thorgrim's men had loaded their boats with whale meat, but as they went to leave, one of their opponents struck Thorgrim's brother a fatal blow. And this is how hunger fades desperate men to come to blows, striking out against one another to survive. Alright, so looking at this, looks like I missed one, two, three, four totems already. Assuming they 
they highlight in sequence if you find them properly. So, I'm not sure if it's like the first Hellblade where if you get, find all the um, lore stuff, if there's like a, a little add-in for something towards the end or not, or if it doesn't matter in this one. Now we gotta find another offering. I saw a thing up there. The hell was that? I just felt some kind of vibration under my feet. Oh, just voiceovers when you replay the game? That's uh, interesting. Is that something that you... Uh, Googled or YouTube there, Brian, or did you actually find all the totems? Altar's right here. But I'm assuming we have to find the other one. Okay. And what does this show us? Oh, maybe that's just showing us that. Okay, so I guess we gotta bounce back and forth between the two, I'm assuming. So let's go this way first. Since it seemed that created a walkway for us. something now man fucking let it go already soulless the best thing you're gonna get out of dragon ball is cell max which we all know wasn't the greatest form of cell that they added later on in super or for super i should say There we go. Okay. How does he have the pencho when he's dead and was never brought back? Sounds like a loser to me. I mean, Kid Boo would wipe the floor with him. <laughs> Sounds like fighting words there are terrible to Patrick. Alright, so now we got a third one we gotta find. Okay. Oh wait, hold on. Shit. Aha! Okay, well let's go this way. Oh wait, hold on. Hmm. So now, looks like we might have to line ourselves up. So. Oh wait, hold on. Oh, so there's a... Hold on. There's a third one now, so hold on, maybe we do need this pathway again. Okay, so let's go back over here. Uh, 
Okay. Aha, there's a third one. Alright, so that's down. Now let's clear this pathway. Oh, hold on, we can jump down, right? Yeah. No, we can't. We have to go all the way around. Wasting our time for a simple puzzle. This one, this offering, and place it on this makeshift rock podium over here. Bring it back to them. Let them see you are not like the others. They let me come up here. Yeah, I see. I think that was the path. Let's see if there's anything around here. And just like the first one, it seems like this one's more story driven than actual combat, which ain't which I ain't complain about. I always like I wouldn't I also I don't mind a good story. I mean not always everything has to be action packed. Now for something like you know, games like Devil May Cry or Doom and stuff like that, then yes, those definitely have to be action packed because I think if it had a story to it, it would just defeat the purpose of the game since those what the games are based on is um, high fast paced combat and with the um, story in between <sighs> let me see now that Dr. Hedo is with Capsule Corp he can work with Boma on a good version of Cell Max and think of that power Frida was too scared blah blah see that's the thing Cell has to be made to be that way all the other guys train to new heights and can surpass him so will always be playing catch up unless they build it into him it's like the same limitations with 17 and 18. i can see that going back and forth for a while with the uh dbz and db super talk on favorite characters and who's better than who based on personal opinion so that's what it all comes down to actually well not actually there are some factual stuff but I'm pretty sure a lot of it is also based on personal opinion too uh, okay so there's nothing up here of interest Wait, she was looking at something. Oh, okay, there's a totem, so I have to see if I can get around to it somehow. Uh-oh. It's getting shadowy now, kind of, which means the goddess will be coming out soon. Garlic Jr. some others ran into rough weather and docked their boat on an island they had not brought fire with them and the merchants complained bitterly seeing a great fire blazing on the other side of the strait Grettir said he would swim over to fetch it he took off his clothes 
and struck out across the water, wearing nothing but a cloak. All right, so that one was a short-lived little tale. The sun looks like it's starting to set. That is just the uh, mountains. And not sure if this is also from the unique effect of having HDR turned on, because I know when I played uh, Gears 5, it was really cool. It was playing in HDR, where like how the certain areas where the sun hits, it would light up. What does it mean? And then if you play it in standard, it's just, you know, it's just it's a sign. whatever. You're on the right path. Yes. Yes, she can still hear. She can. We can follow them. You have to follow them now. Okay. All right. It's coming from down there. Well, let's go down this, this, uh, oh, never mind, never mind. It's just a short-lived cave. I thought it was going to be a creepy cave that we're going to be wandering through for a little bit. The sun is slowly setting, which means shit's going to start happening yeah. very soon. A mirror. Yeah, I know. Well, I mean, yeah. Well, actually, I don't even think I don't even think Twitch uh, supports HDR there, Brian. I think YouTube does because I know I've seen a lot of YouTube videos with um, HDR capabilities. But I tried recording a video. I don't know. I have to go back to my settings. But I tried recording a video in HDR once, and it kept giving me some BS saying, "Oh." Uh, can't, uh, you're something. It gave me some kind of weird error. I had to look at it again, so I have to try it again, but, uh, but I think also Twitch doesn't, uh, Twitch doesn't have the capability of streaming to it in HDR, if I remember correctly as well. Nothing up here. <clears throat> Alright, so there's an offering right there, but... I'm pretty sure something's gonna. Oh, there's a couple offerings, so I'm pretty sure there's gonna be multiple trials that we're gonna have to go through really quick. Maybe. I'm assuming we're probably gonna have to build like a little walkway to get across that lake, I'm assuming. So let's go over here. All right, this uh, these two are gonna keep arguing back and forth. Oh, if there's anyone who's new to my channel, if you like uh, Dragon Ball Z or Super or every single one from Dragon Ball all the way to GT and Super, feel free to chime in on your opinions between my brother-in-law Souls underscore sixty four and my cousin at Terrible Terrors arguing between. Who's better between Frieza and Cell? Which I meant, and by going by current Frieza, and the only really version of Cell is if you haven't, if you've seen Dragon Ball Super Heroes Cell Mac, which to me I think has not really a lot of potential in that, especially since they made him more like a mindless monster. They question me. Are you the one, Sin? She has to be. The lake is here, too. Look at the water. This doesn't feel right. So deep and dark. It is trying to claim us. Trying to take you down with it. Let me see. Alright, so I'm assuming we're going to probably have to find four of these now instead of... I don't like it down here. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so that just swaps their places. Uh, what's up there, Mr. Ito? How are you doing? 
And once again, thank you, by the way, for the uh, many gift subs yesterday. I don't want you to, I don't want you to, you know, break your bank just trying to participate in this giveaway. But I greatly appreciate it. Let me see. Is there any benefit to going that way? Doesn't look like it. Okay, now is there a path? Okay, so there's a path probably this way, maybe? Unless we have to make our own path, let's see. So, probably the easiest of the easy is probably already done. Now we just gotta try and pick and choose how we're gonna get these other offerings. Nice. Right, over here. The hell just happened. Okay. <clears throat> so do this. All right. So now, is this a path that just got created, or...? Hmm. Okay, never mind. So is this one timed base? Is there something in here that's gonna kill me if I take too long? Alright, let's see. Uh... So that didn't do anything. So now, hold on, let's change this up. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Okay, so there has to be something that I'm missing or doing wrong. Unless I had it right just a little bit ago. So that's up, but the ha uh, but uh, but the walk was but the pass was blocked by that little um, makeshift. So clearly they want me to go in here, but how do I fucking get around this? Hmm. Okay. And there's no... Oh shit. Now she can climb up. Which you couldn't climb up before. Droika, why are they here? Were they seeking the hidden room? But this is not a good sign. What were they doing here? They will kill you. If they find you, they will kill you. I don't want to do that. Oh shit! The fuck? <laughs> I probably should deflect that. Ow. Bitch! So I guess you can't deflect them back at them, which sucks. Guys on full on rage mode there. Fucking piece of shit. 
Oh shit. Fuck it. The hell, another one? Son of a bitch and die already. That's right. Get bashed in the face with your own fucking mace breaker. Assuming that's what that was called. I sneezed. Oh, you're talking about the stupid cat. Well, that's no surprise. Since he's a biatch. Okay, so. Okay, yeah, so clear that back. And then now, we gotta put that back. Unless you're talking about Frieza, but I could see Ghost being the coward where any little sound freaks him out. Since that cast the definition of a scaredy cat. There we go. So I'm guessing there's only two offerings, just a little bit more focus items to do for this one. And that's gonna be. No, there shows three, so there has to be another one that's gonna pop up somewhere then. Oh no, we got... Okay, this is the third one. Alright, just go straight forward. Don't bother going around. Taking it the hard way. You are the one. You are the one. Oh, that can't be good. So is she coming up out of the water, or is there a pathway that's being made? Oh, it looks like a pathway that's being made for us. She has been chosen. Fagrima saw it. The part of her she keeps hidden, pushed down, covered with silence. Fagrima saw that too. No matter how much she tries to hide it from the world. Okay, you were talking about ghosts. Now I look back at the now chat. The part of her that scared her for so long, that she fought so hard, has brought her to this place, chosen, special. But will she be enough? Wasn't there a totem over here that I thought Nothing I saw? Else but her. Can she give it? Or did we already find that one? Let me see. I thought there was a totem I saw over here. Maybe not. <clears throat> Maybe it was earlier I was thinking about then we were probably already found it. All right, now let's see what happens when we go through this path. Well, before we go down there, let's see what's around over here. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing of interest. And over here, what about over here? I guess this just gives you another overview of the lake. All right. Time to go descent into possible madness. And there was nothing over here. 
Let me just check one more time. Uh, yeah, okay. Here we go. Alright, now let's see. Is this where we're gonna find the. Ooh, I like the flickering likes. Flashing so sparky. Is this where we're gonna find the, the god? Since there's no light? She's eyeing something. Or she was eyeing something. Okay, so we're gonna need a torch for this, of course. I think it's funny how a torch is conveniently placed there. Darkness. Darkness is coming. Go to them, Samuel. They will tell, tell us how to kill a giant. You know what that means, do you, Samuel? No more sacrifices. I'm hearing the slight sound Once of again, metal in the distance. The sun, <clears throat> plunging into the unknown places which no light touches. She's always been afraid of the dark. Deep, still silence that blinds her eyes till she thinks she will never see again. But there is a thread this time. Connect her to the ones above. She has promises to keep. She will not let them down. Ooh, scary. You know, those are the last famous words when people say, I have a bad feeling about this. What were they looking for? The hidden Kind of reminds me of the caves that we went through in uh, Guam. Not no low crawl like this, but where if you have no light, you're fucked. Alright, so before we go that way, good thing at least everyone had common sense to bring a flashlight. Only because someone actually watched the YouTube video that one of my coworkers shared. Other than that, we probably wouldn't have been able to have ventured off into the cave where they had that little underwater, um, or that little, uh, makeshift, like, uh, pool in the cave. It's getting smaller. Are we gonna have to, like, start crawling through shit? Like them fucking psychotic cave, cave uh... Um, explorers. Maybe your father was right. Maybe you are the thing. Maybe you will die here. Okay, so we gotta get around Just there somehow. The no one will remember you. <clears throat> you will be nothing. Go ahead and listen to this totem really quick. Here it is. The scalds speak of how Grettir, now an outlaw, took rest on the island of Haramsoy with a man called Audun. Grettir saw a great yellow glow like a fire rising from the ground. Ardun told him it was coming from the burial mound of Carr the Old, who ever since he died had haunted the island, and warned him to stay away. Alright, so that was that one. So are you going to travel all the way from Fresno to that little event thing in Turlock that you tag some of us in there, uh, Mr. Ito, if you're still in the chat. Almost kind of looks like the stuff in the alien movies, where the eggs are.
Okay. What? Well, didn't you just didn't you tag some of us in something that you're interested in in fucking Turlock? <clears throat> Unless it was just me that you tagged. Nope. Alright. So, did a pathway just open up? <coughs> the ghost walk. Okay. Unless we have to go back. And backtrack a little. We have to backtrack? Let me see. In darkness. Never easy, is it? Always darkness. Ooh, bones. They failed the test. <clears throat> Were they looking for? Having a darkness. Okay, so I guess this creates a new pathway. Look, there's a, a light shining. Oh, yes. Ooh. <sighs> She was lost, but now they are here. The hidden folk are still here. Look, over there. What can you see? Something different. Come to us. Is it a doorway? Is it? Colors shifting, moving, changing it means something. It must mean something. What does it mean? Alright, so she can't climb up that, so I guess we have to go around in this dark area. Okay. I guess we can't go in there. Hmm. There you go. Nope, oh, and not she has to do any low crawling just yet, so she's lucky so far. But then again, she's probably also skinny enough to fucking crawl on her fucking back end through like some of those crazy ass fucking caves. I guess we can just cross through then. Is it the 13 ghosts? And yet more darkness. More rock. Because I wouldn't mind going looking for what, what, which one is it? The princess one or the the chick that's fucking naked? That's the one I wouldn't mind walking with. <laughs> Are there any quick cave dwellers in here? Endless, endless darkness. What is this? No All right. I guess we're gonna have to just drop down into the darkness. Here we go. This is like James and Silent Hill too, jumping into the unknown. Unknown. <clears throat> Wow, and she actually managed to keep the torch uh, torch lit. It must be a special place. Send what you have to get out of here. You could still die. I was actually expecting the torch to go off, but Oh, never mind. It wasn't even that far of a drop. It just all determined on how deep it was then, I guess. The liar, liar, pants on fires. Why do you have so? I mean, why do you have so much hate for James there, Brian?
what? Was there like a little moment when she temporarily went underneath the water? Okay, so something's in here, I'm assuming. Is there, uh, are we gonna experience some tentacle porn or something? All right. All right, so something tells me we might have to sacrifice our torch, but let's just see if there's anything around here really quick. Can I go up there? Nope, can't. All right, let's see what happens when we light this up. Ah. Now. Okay, so there was no need to probably go down there. I wouldn't be surprised if people actually tried to see if there was anything down there. Aha! Okay, so we're gonna have to go through there and relight our torch. This is a different kind All right. of light. What else can you do but trust him? She doesn't have a choice. So now we gotta sacrifice our torch by going through here. Sometimes she needs the light, but sometimes she needs uh. the Alright. I'm pretty sure once we're gonna have to just rush through it because something might come after us. Now, is there going to be something dark and scary that's... C oh, there's something... Oh, well, is that thing just showing me the path? Or is that thing actually going to come after us if we don't light our torch right away? I'm guessing whatever that is was leading, showing us where we need to go. A lot of these voices do not like Senua. Alright, so I'm assuming we're supposed to drop down there, unless we just walk around like here. Alright, so nothing down there. They made this. They want you to get lost. They take you away. And when you return... Years have passed. The hidden folk. Who the hell are they? Okay, so I'm guessing. I'm guessing that's guiding me to where I need to go. So before we go there, let's see what happens if we go this other way really quick. This place is playing tricks on us. I don't like it. They are here. We are lurking. All right, it's uh no, it should be over here, I believe. what's down here real quick unless it doesn't matter and they both lead up oh, yep here we go I told him the scouts say Gretia wanted the sword that was buried in Carr's how and would not be deterred from seeking it he broke the mound open and started digging until he reached the timber props by this time it was night Audun warned him again uh -huh. not to continue, but Gretir threw down a rope and went inside the mound. No light penetrated it, and it reeked of death, but he persisted in exploring. Yep, I'm assuming there had to have been a bot or a scammer, because I just looked at my, uh, oh shit. I just looked at my subscriber and I'm still at 106, which meant they got scared away when I told them to fuck off if they're just trying to sell me shit. I swear, man, and these fucking cocksuckers are getting fucking annoying. It's like trying to legitimately, legitimately 
gain more followers, but you keep getting all these fucking ass cock sucking bots slash scammers, and it's like it's just, it's just fucking ridiculous. It's like. Pretty much there, Dragonfly. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. Is there a way up here? Nope, looks like we have to go down to the here. Remember the darkness on the water. They know what you're scared of. They can hear us. They can hear you thinking. They can hear what we fear. Wait now. She told the voices in her head to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Creepy shit. Pathway. Oh no shit, there's oh what the hell are those? Your fear is in us. You have to get in. You have to face it. The light, it keeps them away. I was gonna say, is this gonna be one of those stealth things or but I guess not. Like in the uh one of the trials on the first one where you have to get around those Don't listen to them. those things that can't hear. Okay. All right. Something tells me we're probably gonna have to run. I didn't continue through the water. Not sure if uh, you made that mistake or if you actually ended up finding a way around yourself there too, Brian, when you first played this. Aha, here we go. It is only fear. Yes, light, she needs it. She can see again. She has something to keep her at bay. Something for now. Something for now, but not permanently. I'm pretty sure if I would have wandered in the middle of them, they probably would have taken me into the water and killed me. Okay, there goes the uh, thing I was looking for. Following. Of course, more darkness. Oh, shit. Alright, so obviously we can't go in the water. So we're gonna be losing our torch numerous times in this one. Alright, so we're gonna have to light that way after we get this torch lit up. enough the ones you lost everything you regret your shame your pain turn your face to them and open your eyes you can only hide for so long and then you must take the plunge hmm. very so I'm assuming I just have to stay in the light because that's or was there something I missed no, I don't think so, so I might have to just stay in the light.
Yeah, I think as long as we stay in the light, we should be fine. Hopefully no one has a fear of water. Okay. Fuck all of you. You're dead to me. You mean nothing. And then she's gonna go underneath. Put your head under water. Freak out. You're only there for a second. I don't know why you're freaking out so much. I mean, unless you're gonna get pulled in right away, I highly doubt it. Why does it seem like my torch is about to go out? Why do I feel like my torch is gonna go out? Well, that's just a short run, so. Here we go. You want some of this? Yeah, that's what I thought. Bitches. Alone again. You guys are still talking, so I'm not that much of alone. But I think we're done with the torches and stuff now for the moment. Or all together. Who knows? Okay, some more... The hell? Alright, this is interesting. So I'm assuming we have to make our way up to that guy. Whatever he is. Let's go ahead and light this. A brazier? That's what that thing's called? These things are called, I mean? Alright, so we gotta go in there. Okay, can't go that way, of course. Yeah, this game is definitely optimized a lot better compared to Hellblade 1, where there's a little bit of lag, even running at 4K maxed out. I'm running at 4K maxed out here with everything, and it's perfectly fine. Bitch, how many times are you gonna keep repeating yourself? Another test, another test, another test, another test. Once is good enough. After that, shut the fuck up.
Hmm. Okay, so maybe we're supposed to relight that it's one over here then. Bank. Let's see. So we extinguish them and then we had to relight them. Okay. The torch. Give them the torch. It's all she has. She can't give it to them. You will be trapped here, but you won't be able to see. Stop hesitating, just do it. Okay, so that thing just helped me. After these dumb bitches say, Oh, don't give the toilet, you're gonna fuck yourself! <laughs> Shut up. Alright, now I gotta take these out really quick so I can get by. can cross to the other side. She has to find what is hidden. We need to get to the other side. Change the rock back. Make it disappear. Okay, okay so maybe we have to do... S there is a path to find. Pretty sure we're going to have to get our torch back. So dark and scary. Mm. Not that dark. All right, so I guess this is where we get our torch back. Neato. So now that we got our torch back, I'm assuming we're supposed to go this way. So I'm guessing we're supposed to... We haven't passed the test yet. Over there. Where? The cave. Oh, shit. Back to the beginning. Now what? <coughs> she has to get over there. <coughs> Thumbs in, we gotta go back in here now? Is that what they're saying? The voices? I would say Sofia Vergara because I love her accent. Even though I think Sama Hayek does have one too, but Sofia Vergara is fucking hotter in my opinion too. I mean, I'm all for Sama Hayek, but I would take Sofia before Sama. Ha I'll take Sofia before Sama Hayek. Not sure what 
soulless or terrible's responses would be to that. Okay, so... Is there something that I'm missing? Let me see something real quick. Man, you crazy. Go there, the path is Ah, here you go. Can she get through? Alright, and always wants to give up our torch again, I take it. You will find a way out. Trust yourself, trust your own The way will find you. The path <coughs> Oh, is he gonna relight that path for me? Okay. So I'm guessing I lost my torch now. I think everyone has seen her from Dust Till Dawn. Like that guys. I can see again, moving, guiding you through the dark. You can breathe again. Still dark. Now this is really cool. The darkness. I know it's mostly just dark, but shit. Are you strong? <sighs> they will tear it from her mouth. Alright, sounds like go down. <laughs> you ring that one in the mouth. Fucking piece of shit. Oh, get the hell off me. Fucking little monkey. Any more of you? Fucking bastards. Alright, something telling me that we're gonna. She still has her sword out, which means something's gonna happen again. Something. No, nothing. Nothing is here. Nothing is here. Why? Something sound like it's running behind me. Oh shit! The hell? How is it that we did not fall off the edge? There could be more. Another one dead. What is down there? Where did it go? Yep. It fell right there. Punk ass bitch. Oh, just got a checkpoint, so something, something more is going to be happening. I noticed the voices in my head change are changing a little bit. Get the 
fuck off. The fuck? You just throw dirt at me, son of a bitch? Fuck you. Thing around here. An entrance. Keep following. Or just another trick from the hidden folk. Another trick. What do they want with us? Luring you in. Keeping you here. Be careful. <laughs> Did the light. Oh. Well, that's a fuck up situation to be in. <laughs> this is like almost like some descent shit. Bitch. Like Marcus Phoenix would say, where are these things made of shit? What the hell is that? <laughs> Bitch! Oh, what oh what the hell? This guy went full on berserk mode and it knocked me out of my fucking focus. <laughs> Get this monkey off my back. Bitch! I oh, just saw the checkpoint marker, so this should, I should be good now. Tacos El Toucan? Hmm. Uh, shit. It's dark. I don't know where the fuck I'm at. Oh, here we go. No, still has the sword out, which means there's still more shit that's gonna happen. Ooh, light now. Still daylight. Torch, maybe. <clears throat> Who is it? Who? Is someone there? Who are they? Who's there? What are they saying? Don't get too close. Who is this me? No. <clears throat> you can't. Those creatures are down here with you. They need help. This is all I have. So no, you can't. You can't do it. <clears throat> she is thinking about it. No, Sonny. Protect us. We need that sword. Sonny, no. And let me guess. It's all you we willingly give the sword, so now it's going to be all stealth stuff. Must have meaning. She has given away that which makes her strong. Her protector. Her avenger. The thing she grips tight when darkness overwhelms her. What is warrior without her sword? What is she now? 
she must forge a new path, defenseless against the dead ones. The armor has fallen away. All right. It better be worth it, asshole. Cause something tells me I'm a. Oh yeah. Either a little cat and mouse or stealth. What's up, Mary? How are you? Shadows. Always another task. Too much darkness now. Where are you taking me, hidden folk? All right. No, you are powerless. Don't lose the light. I'm trying not to. But if you guys keep talking, I might get distracted, so shut the fuck up in my head. There you go. <coughs> okay, so it's just like the... Just like in the first game where we gotta stay in the lights to survive. <coughs> I think it's funny though how she's like moving cautiously instead of just running. Another trick. At least run in the light. You don't have to be like a little cautious about it. I'm pretty sure this game would pro would probably creep my sister out or give her make her nervous. Does it have eyes? It can smell us. It will kill you. It is looking for us. It knows. There's more of them. So this is one of those things where we just stop moving. It is definitely like some descent shit. Wiener schnitzel sounds good. I think I might hit that up for dinner. Cause we all know Souls underscore 64 wants them all beef hot dogs. Oh shit, I lost the light. This is what you feel. Oh, okay, here we go. What you cannot see. It has come for you. Just trying to make it out of this darkness. Light shiny. Light shiny. That'd be some scary shit, especially when you can't see the bottom of the cave. Well, actually, I could kind of see the bottom of it. Can do this. Just shut the fuck up. Go, go, Let's go, 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 go. I hate it here. It's too terrifying. All right, more following the psychedelic lights. Sometimes oh, now she's running. She feels the darkness will never end, or worse. It will get deeper and darker until she's crushed under it. Her last breath floating up to the sky, she will never see again. What the hell is this freaky? Sh this shit. Invitation. They draw her onwards, just out of reach. There. <laughs> Floating rocks and shit. She's close now. Uh, 
All right. I would like to get my sword back from whoever I fucking loaned it to. It better be worthwhile. <laughs> Nothing over there. Floating rock. Up. So I'm guessing we're supposed to go that way, but before we go there, let's see if there's any more lore around here. Yep, here's one right there. Gretier found the sword he was seeking, Kar's loom, buried in the grave mound. He went to leave, but before he could reach the rope, something grabbed him from behind, and Gretier realized the mound dweller would not let his <coughs> treasure go. The two fought ferociously until Gretier got the advantage and chopped off the Revenant's head. But Carr's loom would prove his undoing, fated to be the sword that killed him. Alright. So I'm guessing that's probably the only hidden lore down here, because I don't think there's anywhere else to go. Yeah, okay. Moving on. This is the last test you can see. The fuck is that? This is the last trial. The hidden folk are here. They have tested us so long. And now <gasps> they have brought you to the last figure again. again. Who is that? There. The tunnel way to get over there. She needs to get over there. How will she do it? Okay. So we gotta solve a puzzle somewhere. Or something. The path is open. Follow it. Okay. We failed. Now, let's see. Let me see something. And now you brought it down. Hmm. Oh. Now the world changed a little bit, or just the center. Okay. Uh. Okay, not sure what that did for us or means to us, but let's just check this out. Nothing there. Alright, so can we climb up here? Or if not, we might have to change some things. Nope, can't climb up there, so let's change everything. Looking at something. Or maybe I was supposed to change this and backtrack. Let's see. Maybe that's what I was supposed to do. Let me see something really quick. Let's be on the other side really quick. <clears throat> okay, so now let's do this. Okay, so 
now we go this way. see that thing. So wait, there's a path over there, but hold on. But it looks like there's a gap. So there's gotta be something I gotta do prior to crossing that, probably. that again really quick. Wasn't there something over here with that rock or is that supposed to be like that? All these mind games. Now we gotta focus on that. Yes, the tunnel. Yes, you brought it down. You made it happen. Now you just have to get to it. How's she gonna get to it? She doesn't know. It has to be a way. She's looking. We need to find a way. Let's go ahead and change this real quick. She didn't know what she was doing, but now, now, look at her. How could you know? She knows how to look at it. There's no way you look at it. Which game does this remind me of where you have to like constantly like change things around just to get just to complete like a simple task? I mean I know there's a lot of games that probably require you to do a lot of repetitive stupid shit. And then all the rocks come tumbling down. <laughs> all right, time to head into the light. You are ready. We have showed them everything we are. Every fragment. Every scar. We have nothing left. She can see herself. All and the other selves. Us. Me. She is thinking in all the pieces. We helped you find courage, an unbreakable purpose. It started with a promise that holds so much power That's over you. Important to me, so. Dillian. Always love. Always death. death. And at the end, 
Damn, you sure taking your sweet ass time to crawl through this little kick crevice. I mean, granted, you're too busy listening to the stupid voices in your head, too. His goodness. Yeah. And you saved him. And he saved us. Now, if we defeat her, El Toiga. El Toiga. She has no ass. <clears throat> like yours. You know, you know for a god, you would think she'd have an ass on her. No one's claustrophobic. I know this would probably give our friend Scott fucking nightmares. Slipping through her soul. Following the threads of her mind. She's here to find them. The ones who hide. They will tell her how to defeat the giants. And she will keep her promise. Right, so still stuck in the cave. But it's never so simple, is it? Wisdom has a price. There will always be a part of you that changes. A part of you that darkens. And a part of you that dies. Ah. They are watching us. More scammers. <coughs> you should never have come here. They can see us. What is going to happen? It's time to find out. How can we make it happen? Let them down. She is ready. They know. Go. Who are these around you, Senor? Those you have saved. Those who have led to death. If I remember correctly, I think this was the scene that they demoed when they finally gave this a release date. You see things differently from the others. Look, and you will see her. 
All right, now where are we at? days the air was sweet and fresh the ground and the sea gave up their bounty they knew that after all their fighting they had found somewhere to rest somewhere to carve out a home now. all right so now we are back into eternal darkness with a torch Askia screamed her fury. Her words blotted out the sun. She cut the grimoire with her bitter poison and drowned the hills in bile. Oh, something's going on. Not work related to me. Well, kind of. Something about. Could breathe through her hatred. Something about the army Boy size getting activated or something. I'm guessing they're needing vehicles. Their crops withered in the ground. And the people. This one is definitely more dialogue than the first one. This is the way that the weak lost all to the strong. With the weakest of all in her arms, still she searched for a haven. The darkness from the sky reached down. The flesh eating ones with the awful hunger that could never be sated were a legion. And death held dominion over all. And the gods rose. She could not let the child live in such a world. So she brought her to a cave where the hidden folk were set to live, hoping they would take her child and raise her free from care. Free. Fucking heads that just cut out. Good thing it didn't happen she during had the dialogue. To feed her now, but her rage and despair. She made a deal. I will give myself to you, Askia, if you will give me the power to triumph in this world you <clears throat> have created. Take. Is that supposed to be the story about that Etuga god or whatever or something, I'm assuming? Help. 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 
help me. All around. They're coming. Everywhere. You need to fight. Give me the sword, you ass fuck. I need the sword. Please hurry. Make her give you the sword. Make I can't her. let them down. You need that sword. You are nothing without your sword. I need the sword. So wait, were we just talking to ourselves? I need the sword. Please. She survived. Survived without her sword. And now she has it back. Invested with her sacrifice. All her blood that might have spilled. All the death she might have died. A new sword. A new self. A new Senua. Who can see the giant's truth. You are fast. <laughs> Bitch! Oh, what the hell is this shit? Ow, he's biting me! The fuck is biting me? Oh, there we go. I'm blind! God damn it, get off me. God damn! You the shit? Die already. Now what? Is this like a gonna be a quick time event or is this supposed to Never mind. God damn it. Fucking cocksuckers are there. I mean, granted, I shouldn't complain since there's since we're in, involved in a little bit of combat now instead of just strictly running around listening to dialogue. Yeah. 
Motherfucker! Well, I keep getting checkpoints, so I'm assuming this is gonna happen for a little bit. Do you see how the pitiless world stamps you down? Jesus Christ. Talk about a dog pile. Do you hate It was like cannibal holocaust shit with the gangbang. Secrets fester in the So I guess that was the story about El Toyka then. Toyka's real, man. Ingram. Her name. Ingram. We all have names given or chosen. We change them. Charge them. Invest them with meaning. Names torn away leave us raw and bleeding. That was behind us. That was probably that guy. <clears throat> All the names that were lost, she will find and hold. She knows her name now. In heaven, she knows her. Funny how he just mysteriously just shows up. You know her name, I understand her. Not a monster after all. <coughs> She's lost in her brain. She was you found what you saw it. I know what they were trying to show me. I know Il Tiger's true name now. Names of power. True names. They cut to our hearts. To know the true name of Sophie is to command it. Can we call to her? Like the dragon did. She will kill you. The dragon were aping the costumes of the living. I don't know what they did before they turned. The grotesque parody of the blowed ones held in that sacred place. Sacrifices to Freya. We can call to her too. Yes. Yes, she will come. But she will kill you. Just like she has so many of us. And what? She can never be reached. We need to find a place. Where you can meet her face to face and see the world through her see eyes. Her world. <coughs> and there are ways of opening up the door into another space. Another place. Fire and rage. The veil. It hides the bed of it as they whisper. Us. The veil. Through which you can sometimes catch a glimpse. She understands. There are ways to tear that open. She knows. Pass it. It won't be the first time. 
She's suffering. Wrecked with grief, I saw it. Even the folk showed her. A ritual. A ritual. A ritual to open up the door. A ritual to heal her pain. Meet her eyes. And speak her name. A ritual. Alright, so either chat is just quiet at the moment, or it's just my app acting up again. <clears throat> But of course, everyone's probably just doing their own thing, just listening to my stuff in the background, which is alright too. Alright, where are we going now? Where are you taking us? So do we have to wait until nightfall? I'll take that as a yes. A boss fight or what? So I'm guessing this is probably going to be like a stealth thing. I'm assuming this is one of those things where she can't see me. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not sure why the mouse is now showing up down there. Oh, what the hell? Or maybe I was too close. So I'm gonna have to break these chains, probably. No problem. What the hell? Oh, shit. Okay. Ow. makes no sense. At least it's not instant death where you have to start over again, but shit. Sounds like she's not too happy. 
Really? Okay, so I'm guess I have to stay in the shadows then, which I thought that's what I was doing, or at least just be behind cover. But I guess the shadows are whatever. Hala. I will break your chains. Is this all of them? Maybe not. Okay, so now we just gotta get around here. It was one of those things where we just have to stay out of her sight. Climb up there, Senua. more chains does this bitch got? The hell? Oh shit. Alright, I'm guessing this is one of those things where we just gotta run it now. Looks like it. Try the last one. Funny how they spell hell with one L instead of two. <clears throat> now she's all contorted and shit. So I'll probably consider this more of a mini boss fight than an actual boss fight. Silence. Since it was pretty straightforward. She is gone now. All the rage. All the fear. The grief. All died with her. You didn't see it. Now you hold her close. You think you have triumphed. But this means nothing. This woman was no god. She was weak, like you. 
This changes nothing. I need to go home. Will your father join us if you tell him what you saw? Yes. He will not run from battle. He will lead us into it. There is more than the sword here. More than he can understand. No more slaves. And no more sacrifices. Do you swear? No more sacrifices. No more cowering in our fortress. We could fight. We have, but not in the way he thinks. No more sacrifices, swear. I never wanted any of that. I just did not believe it was possible to defeat them. And now I see. A ray of hope. If this is real, no more sacrifices. You have my word. Be sure of that. She is. We leave at sunrise. I will come with you. I know the cause. And he respected me once. I will bear witness to what was done here today. Hmm. What are we going to do next? All right. So now we're gonna return this guy back home she now. Stop the slavers, but the signs are leading her down a different path. She won't have to fight them. Just show them. How the world can change. No more giants. No more sacrifices. She has found out the secret. She has the key, but... Wisdom has a price. Remember? What happens when you face the void and human eyes look back? She can meet these eyes and take that burden, but it takes its toll. This isn't the right way. I told you we need to head further inland. Oh, perhaps you're right. We need food and shelter. And there is a settlement nearby. Bothervik? Yes. Are you mad? They will kill me on sight. They hate the Bjork. <gasps> They've been pains in our houses since long before the fall. And do you think you might have given them a cause to hate you? Hmm? Don't worry, lad. I'll protect you. <laughs> all right, now we're venturing into an area of people that hate this guy, but they all have reason to, since he's a dick. All right, nothing back there. <clears throat> what is this place? It's beautiful. So pretty. as much this place as the fire and sharp rocks it should be done. Yes. Oh, something called us here. Something in there. Us here. Something special. They just disappeared. That or we're just losing our minds again. Can you see? We give you this moment as reward. Hopeful. The light is so bright. You know, so this is what it feels like when you follow your destiny. You know what? where you belong the beauty of it nope nothing down there <clears throat> I wonder how that would look without the HDR effect probably not as bright and blinding <clears throat> remember 
Alright, so it looks like that's an area we can drop down from <laughs> after a certain point. to pay attention to what's happening on our work because I don't think any of it really applies to me at the moment. Ah, here we go. The Scald's verse tells how Grettir made many enemies with his proud and overbearing nature. Always quick to anger, his strength and fighting prowess meant that even the most trivial of quarrels met a fatal end. The kinsmen of those he killed or maimed were angry. And because he was an outlaw, no one was allowed to help him. Alrighty. Not using the keyboard mouse, using my controller. Drop back down over here. Go back up y'all. I saw, I noticed for the past few days, a couple days actually, not a few days, that uh, if, you're, if you can hear me there, so if that you've been playing that DC Universe, I'm surprised you and Brian haven't done like a stream together playing that game. Because I'm pretty sure they have like team stuff, <clears throat> just like Smash Bros. Is it really key stuff? Oh, and look, and they just show up. It's beautiful. Yes, it is. Even now. Who are these? An ambush. Guiding the Björk to our door, Valkyrie. Is this what you've been reduced to? How does she know them? Why does she hate me? Let him go! No. Who is this woman? Ortlur. This is not what you think. What then? What is it? I know this is going to be hard to believe, but you have to listen. This woman here, Senua, she knows how to defeat the giants. We've, all of us, we've, we've seen it. She to trust us. Boss, make her trust us. She will believe you. Impossible, they can't be killed. We thought so too, but we saw it. We saw it, Austridor. We're on our way to Borkarvirki now to tell the Kodi, to make him understand that we, we can fight back. He's telling the truth. I did not ask you, Rat. Shut your mouth, or I will slit your throat. She is special. I know you have no love for the Bjork, but you can't trust me. Will she? This is the turning point, Austrider. We can start over, start to rebuild what we had. <clears throat> I should trust Parker. If this is true. Yes. She believes you. She wants to believe you. She's trying to understand. If this is true, you, Senua, tell me now. Say it is true. She's exhausted. You can speak. She wants to believe you. Speak to her. She tell wants her. to trust you. Tell her the truth. It is true. She will believe us. Okay. Prove it then. There's a giant here. Another giant. Another giant. He roams the beaches and sinks our boats, cutting us off from the sea. More death. And we're close to running out of food. More darkness. We can help these people. You can overcome it. 
Kill it. We need to get to Borgavik. Please. Remember, there are other people we must save. I cannot let more of my people die. Don't get distracted. We should kill it. We've taken down one, but there is a whole land of them. We need to practice. And I want to don't. fight. There's no way you can win. Please. Senua. People will die if you stay here. We are dying. People will die if you don't. You have to help her. Now it is time to leave, Senua. Now you have to choose. You can feel it. All right. Hold on to her. We will help. Her people deserve hope, too. Harald. Take them to the settlement and keep an eye on the Bjark. We want to help her. Senoa, come with me. Trust us. Trust us. I will show you the giant. All right, so now we gotta prove ourselves, like always, just to gain trust from other people by doing something for them. What a surprise. <clears throat> That sounds a little overly dramatic. All her life she had been alone. No. Not alone. Not quite alone. But in this loneliest place she has found others. Lost in darkness. Just like she was. Others who might look to her to lead them into the light. Can her shoulders bear this burden? She so learned to keep her guard up, can she ever let it down? You are an outlander. Why are you here? Okay. I came as a slave. Can you trust Taken him? by the Björk? Yes. You were taken by the Björk, and yet you come here with Thorgestur. He wants to stop the giants too. We want the same thing now. To stop the giants. She doesn't trust him. Be careful. The Björk can't be trusted. They demand food from us, and if we don't give it, they take us as sacrifice. What else is new? Do you understand? She knows what it's like. Well, just like anything else, people are always going to sacrifice others just to save themselves. Yep, we're getting close. That's him. That's him. Salvaris, the sea giant. Do you see him? Where is he? He brings the storms with him. We haven't seen the sun in weeks. With winter upon us, the storms will only get worse. They are running out of time. It's too late. They will die. All of them. Come. Baldrvik's just over there. Follow her. He is calling to us. He knows we are here. My brothers used to come here to practice fighting. Sneak out. Follow them. She's a fighter like you. Learning by watching. Like you. They're dead now. I'm all that's left. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. But that's uh, life, unfortunately. She is alone like you. Alone in the world. Who do you have? No. Yeah, at least you have someone, bitch. I just have nothing but the sick ass voices in my head. What about your family? It's just me left. Don't tell her. What happened to them? Don't tell her. You can't tell her. Someone can't trust her. She might understand. She won't. No one. No one knows what it's like to be you. Don't tell her about your mother. She'll turn from her. Turn from us. Run away. 
they always do. What about your mom? <clears throat> My mother was a fighter. She never gave up. A fighter up. like her. Not even at the very end. So strong. She is not giving up. Things funny how she's still talking. No, we're not even near her. All of them. She loved them. She lost them. Yep, there goes something over here. So, gonna have to leave you for a moment there, bitch. Gonna listen to this, but I'm assuming this is probably the path over here. Some more lore to listen to than to hear your your agonizing pain and suffering of responsibilities. The outlaw Gretir fled to the island of Drangi. His enemies knew he was there, but he was still so strong and fierce, nobody could shift him. Thorbjorn, first among his foe, sent his foster mother to see Grettir. She was a Saithkona, and very wily. She enchanted a tree branch and sent it to wash up on Drangi. Grettir tried to cut it up for firewood, but his axe flew back and struck him in the leg. Damn. The wound blackened and festered, and Grettir feared his time was close. Oh, that had to have sucked. Alright, back to this chick. Uh, just to hear more about her life's problems. Yep. Alright, let's hear more about how adulting sucks. We used to have an easier passage up. We don't have the tools to make repairs. Can you climb this? Yes. I need a place to live. Let's get the plans like it's nothing. You must follow. She knows this place. She understands it. She loves this place. Even now, even after all of that, she leads the people here. Was he the leader here? Yes. He was the best of men. A leader like your father. <laughs> a leader like you. Not like your father. He was just and generous and kind. Too kind. Too kind. What does she mean? <laughs> he trusted the wrong person. And he was betrayed. A traitor? Who? Try to follow in his footsteps. She wants to keep her people safe. <clears throat> she has to. But it's hard. She has to carry on for her father. What about me, son? So I'm assuming she was betrayed by the same people that's been enslaving everybody to use them as sacrifices. All that just to get around a broken bridge. <clears throat> Something's wrong. Not right. <laughs> <laughs> Yes! 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 
Did I just throw it back at him? Was that because of the focus attack? What the hell kind of attack was that? God damn it. Really? God damn it. Shit, die already. Is that the last one? I thought there was more. She left you to fight the Draco. How could she? She sees we are strong. She knows. We can fight. What a bitch. You cannot trust her. Alright, so let's see what's over here. Anything up here? That's why it's giving us the option to climb up here, or what? Hmm. Okay, I'm guessing it's just to give us a little bit of a look of the lay of the land. I guess well, their way of compensating with the the less yeah, combat sure. is to make it a little bit more difficult. Since there's less combat in this, seems like in this game than in the first one, they compensate it by making the fights a little bit more challenging and aggressive. This isn't right. All right, so we're having the multicolor, the Technicolor Dream effect again, huh? They blocked you. Let it block you. What do they want? You know how to do it. Here. It's there. Something to find. The hidden phone. Alright, now we gotta do this. Solve some puzzles. The world has changed. It's different now. The rain has stopped. Working on it. So there might be different ways or paths here that we might have to take. Take and change this up. Oh, that's right, so it's multiple symbols that we're looking for. She needs the name. Okay, so, oh, hold on. Alright, so I thought more stuff was getting drawn out. Let's see really quick. So that's that symbol. Find the next. 
next time you find the next sign, there will be another one. You have to find a way through. Quick. How do you kill the sea giant? She can't. She doesn't know it's real now. She needs to know more. You can there only kill it if you find out more. <laughs> She's finding a way through. Right now we gotta change this back. Find another way to see. There's got to be <laughs> we'll go back Look over here. The to find the last set of symbols. She did it. You did it. And that's all she wrote, folks. You found the path. The meaning is clear. We see everything. The hatred in their hearts. Shalvanesi was born of this place. We saw it. Seek us again. How far did this bitch run off to? Shit. There she is. I thought you just hang the out. Don't usually come this close to the settlement. The dragon. I have to warn them. Your followers too. Here as well. They're not my followers. I just showed them how things could be different. But they follow you. She was with you. She left us. Maybe one day don't I can also see how things can be different. We need to find the hidden thing. Find them. You're not coming? There's something I need to find. Bardavik is just along the shore. I would say be careful of the river, She needs to understand. I see you can find handle way. yourself. She can't handle herself. You are a warrior, so she left left to say right. things hard. Till we meet again. What are they looking for? Are they following us? Yes, they must be following us. What if she brought them here? What if it was a trap? <gasps> she is strong. She dealt with them. And I wonder, assuming we're coming up on a boss fight, I wonder, I, I, I remember them showing some giant that was part of the showcase when, before this even had a release date, I just remember when they announced it with uh, like a teaser. I remember they were showing like some kind of giant at, like a sh like at a beach or something. It has to probably be this. If not yet. Alright, so now we're gonna go into the Cave of Wonders again. I'm seeing yellow, which means are we gonna have to solve another puzzle again? Well, yep, there it is. Things again. If you want them to help you again, you have to find your way to them. <sighs> See if there's any symbols we can pinpoint in this location before we transition. Doesn't look like it. Hold on. Hold on. All right, 
looks like we have to transition this. What are we looking for? Okay, here we somewhere go. It's gotta be somewhere around here. Okay, I'm seeing. Oh, no. I've gotta line something up, probably. No, not there. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Maybe here. Yep, right there. Yes, she That's found one. it. Found it. Now let's go travel this way. And keep looking. You need to find the right way to look at it. The right way to see it. She did. Right now is the other symbol gonna be around here. Open the path for me, please. He comes from. The sea. They All right, so next symbol. Find the symbol. And you A lot of changing the reality really quick just to find these puzzles. Or symbols, I should say. Another symbol down. Now we gotta find the third one. Which means we gotta go back and backtrack. Manipulating reality just to get to the other side, because that's she probably where the other symbol's gonna be. She needs to understand. If you want to kill him, you need to know. I need to know his name before I could kill him. Oh, looks like there's a cross space, so probably the last symbols in here then. Clever girl. Oh, 
or maybe not. Oh, lore, so I can't complain about that. The scalds say Grettir, wounded by Sather, was now so weak it was possible for his enemies to defeat him. Under cover of night, Thorbjorn and his men attacked his shelter. They tried to disarm him, but he clung so firmly to his sword, Kar's loom, that they had to cut off his arm to get it free. Then they used his sword to cut off his head, and the land's mightiest outlaw was dead. All right, so second to last story, which means we're probably getting close towards the end of this game, maybe. Is there anything around here of interest? No, doesn't look like it. All right, back around to head closer to the path where we're supposed to go, because I think that's where the other symbol probably might be. Back up here. Go around. I think that's where we're supposed to go. I need to go. Oh, what the hell? There's anything, anything back there, but who knows? Let me go over here. One more simple, which has to probably be in this direction. Open up a path over here. I think it did. Okay, go up. <coughs> yep, starting to see the symbol, so this has to be it. Now we just gotta line ourselves up somewhere. Probably here. Let's see. Go between here. There we go. Last symbol has been found. Yes, I am sure. That is a risk I am willing to take. Some of these puzzles can take, I would say, a lot of time, just a little time. But it's just the creativity that that really counts. This power she feels draws her on. The certainty she wants to hold it, even <clears throat> if it blinds her. The light that blinds. Another promise, <laughs> another question. But there will always be that price to pay. The truth can drown you deep. 
they bear the heart of you hidden for years. It hurts. <coughs> Down there, see the water. Where? So are we gonna jump into that or something? She has to go down again. Okay. Continuing our descent into madness. to the water and then focus or what there we go every monster was once a man we will show All right, so I guess, what, are we technically in the water now? Yeah, it looks like it. So we're about to learn this monster's name or something. When the darkness came, the man stood shoulder to shoulder with his friends. They helped each other through the starvation and the fear. And there was a tiny spark of hope. I do like this. This is pretty cool. The slow motion running because, you know, she's underwater and all that stuff. But then the giants came. And the Droigar. Way more dialogue in this one than in the first one, that's for sure. <clears throat> So, just like Ingun, if I pronounce that, I made a sacrifice and then ended up becoming tormented and a giant.
All right. Then he became a god. Or monsters, however you want to look at it. So is this going to be another mini boss fight or an actual fight fight? I guess we just need to know the backstory and then we're gonna brief it to that one chick and then hopefully she should know. Oh, I know who that is! Damn, now we're gonna start all over again. He comes to the settlement. find this chick or is there still more to up oh. look at him she sees what he does the constant storm the constant fear no sunshine nothing no light but the torches are still there everybody hiding lonely tucked away locked door they never come out life is just endurance here I mean, do you blame them for hiding? Unbearable. I mean, granted, you probably could only hide so long from a giant before it tears down your house. Okay, no stories to listen to. Let's go ahead and move on. Check over here. This door is locked too. <clears throat> I'm guessing all these doors are probably locked. So. Oh, what's over here? Oh, never mind. I'll say. Or else, what would be the point of trying to open them? Let me in! Let me in! if you can hop over there because it looked white but I guess not because there's Everything. some obstructions in the way. Everything falls apart. Everything dies. The rain never stops. They survive. death here. In spite of everything, <coughs> she's strong. Our Stutra holds them together. She deserves more than this. They deserve more than this. How has she kept them together? <coughs> we must find her. She will help us. Ah, here it is. Last story. brave and fine deeds brought him misery so fate makes prisoners of us all but it was Grettir's nature that made him fight the Droiger, and Grettir's nature that led to blood feud and exile so what is truly our prison Senua is our path ordained and we powerless to change it or do we blame uncertain powers 
for what we ourselves ordain. All right, so we missed six parts of the story, unfortunately, which is a lot more than what I missed in Hellblade One. gotta have an unlocked door. Well, I guess since there's no more stories to read, if those go in sequence, then we can just stop trying to look around, just go straight forward. And try and see, not sure how much more is left of this game, I'm assuming we're gonna be close, we're closer towards the end now. Come. <clears throat> Astrior. You have to ask her. More. What were you searching for? The truth. The truth. Ask her. Steady. Take your time. Tell her. Your father. There. <coughs> That's it. You told me that someone betrayed him. Who? Who was it? She has to tell us. She will. Why? I need to know his name. What does it matter? The truth. It is how we will save her people. I need to understand him. Please. You need to know. You must know. Tell me what happened. We cannot kill the giant if we do not know. She's going to kill us. She trusts us. No, she doesn't. She's ready. Give me the damn name, bitch. The question hurts her. She will do it. When it all went to hell, People started coming to us for help. We were just barely scraping by, but she doesn't like to remember. We opened our doors to them. She's trying to help. Even as the food was dwindling, and the Björk grew more demanding. It's hard for her to say. Little by little, this settlement became my tribe just like yours remember you had a home and then a man came and we took him in we made him one of us that man we trusted him what was his name and he betrayed me he betrayed my father it was him. there is more to this than she is saying so I cast him out. I haven't seen him since. His name was Saikir. The truth. There it is. Now we know the truth. Now you know. You can use it. You can trust her. Tell her. I'm sorry. But Saikir. He. Is your giant? What will she do? Will she believe us? I saw it. She has to. How? You have to trust me. It was the same with Inga. I saw her. I learned her name. Someone's coming. They've never attacked the settlement before. I'm with you. All right now. Oh shit. Okay, oh, there's what's the name? Alright, so now we got another fight sequence going on. Oh. Come on, fuck this fool up. Oh shit, she just got a spear in her fucking throat. Oh, 
Focus on this fool real quick. You can't block a punch. That's stupid. Oh shit. He just took one for the team. Bitch! Funny how the deflex doesn't bounce the weapon back to him like in the first one. Well, no help for you, bitch. You're dead. You are a lost cause. Alright, now we got this asshole. That's so stupid how he doesn't even get hurt by his own attack. First off, I move, and I'm dead. Motherfucker. Really? Yeah, I know a heavy cat probably distract you or break that shield. Fuck these assholes. Die already, big ugly piece of shit. Really? Really? Fuck your shield attack, you little bitch. Fire guys are fucking assholes. Really? How the fuck do they still hit you when you die? That makes no goddamn sense. Boy, they really do make you rely on the focus way too much on this one. Yeah, 
Damn, these fucking fight sequences, man. Ow. Stop swinging for the fences already, you fucking big ugly fuck. Alright, who else is left? Unfortunately, that's what it is. Death. It was like that in Hellblade 1, so it's like that in 2. Everywhere we go, we bring death. figure now always coming all the death yes all the suffering right there you have brought this on them he's right you with your darkness all because of you your curse you tell yourself you are trying to help you have damned them all Bullshit from scammers. No surprise. Take it away. Oh, I will protect them. It's too late. You can't protect anyone. Your father was always right. You will rot your darkness. Die with them. Taking over everyone alone. Are you hurt? You don't deserve her help. Don't let her in. She sees us. She sees what you are thinking. She needs you to be strong. Can you? Can you be? We need a plan. Depends on the plan. <coughs> Go with her. She is too kind. She's brought them here, the hungry ones. She made them the fight hungry the ones. ones who died. <coughs> There's only one way to return. Go forward. Go on. Steal yourself for what's to come. I 
know his name. I can draw him into the sun. The sun never shines where Selvarishn walks. He brings the clouds with him. There's a way to part the clouds. We must perform a ritual to honor the sun and draw a soul from wherever she's fled and beg her help. Vagrima. Yeah? Find the site for the ritual. We will go to the cave and wake the giant with fire. Then lure him there. He may look slow, but he moves fast. Our people will slow him down. Then I will speak his name and hold him fast. And bring him into the light. Yeah. Another ritual, and away we go. I think this was the giant that they showcased when they first announced this game. Wait. Let... Now she has war paint on. Okay then. Farik, this way. Hmm. Come this way. There he is. Crystal points out that she's not on it, and you add her. Oh, okay, so I guess she's moving on her own now. Damn, you gonna let Crystal tell you how it is there, Jeremy? Looks like he's missing part of his other arm. It's just a stump. Undermine, it's right there. It's just contorted. Oh no, no, it's not. Appreciate it. I want to complain about it though. I mean, you know, you have your favorites for a reason, right? Or shout outs and stuff. Okay, so it's all part of the uh, motion, the motion video, not actual gameplay. Alright, so are we stuck in a oh never mind. He's on fire! <laughs> yeah. Okay, so now we're controlling Senua for this. Okay. So 
So I'm guessing these guys better be conducting the fucking ritual when we draw this guy out. Oh yeah, okay. This does look familiar. So this definitely is the giant that they showcase when they finally, um, when they announce the teaser for this game. I'm assuming we're supposed to just hit him in the head. Unless we're just supposed to just randomly throw it. Yep. There goes that. Oh shit, he just got his head fucking bit off. Bit off. Hell just happened. All right. I need to get to the eye of the storm. Find him. All right. Now we're in a different reality, or other world, I guess you would say. While well, shit's happening in the present. And they kind of abandoned me a few years ago when I thought they were my friends, but they just sounds like high school drama, so I'll just say I got rid of them because they no longer stream. <laughs> well, shit does happen there, Jeremy. So how are you feeling? You still feeling shitty or are you actually feeling a little bit better? Oh shit the bed! Was that Of course that happens right when I fucking jump down. When it looked all clear at first. The fuck? The waves will pull me under again. Okay. I'm assuming I was doing Or am I supposed to stand like on that little what looks like a ledge? Oh, here we go. I guess that makes sense. This one seems like it's a little bit tad more easier than the other one. You know, that one was kind of simple and straightforward too. Oh shit. Come on! How much more? How much more? There comes the wave. You know that shit's probably gotta hurt too.
Alright, so I'm guessing... Since we have the semi-high ground that we are good at the moment. Savior, I can help you. Oh. I would have... I'd probably say like Thursday night it started to get a little worse for me because then that's when I, the headache started kicking in. I felt like not wanting to do anything. Oh shit. Okay, let's wait for the wave to pass really quick. Wait for the wave to pass. I had a feeling that one was just going to be temporary. Go over here real quick, where it's a little bit safer. Just book it. Vault over. Alright, here we go. So, unlike the other one where we had to break or change, this one, I guess we have to just get to the eye of the storm and that. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, shit. Just falling from the sky. Oh shit. I guess we're getting close to the eye of the storm. That's why shit's fucking. Oh, what the hell? Shit's spinning around and fucking get thrown at me. Ow. Alright, I guess I need to look to the sky on this one. Well, this is making it kind of a little difficult trying to look forward and not get pelted with sh heavy shit at the same time. Oh, okay. <clears throat> oh, do we make it to the eye of the storm now? I will guide you to the light. Don't, I don't your grace. Come back, Sagir. Now he's gonna fucking kill over and rest in peace. Another haunted spirit given peace. 
Another victim of the ravaged land now rests. A promise kept. Our lives lost in calming the storm. Fight is ahead. Oh. The giant of Borgavarki is strong. We are But strong. I believe in you. Together. I want the bloodshed to end. Are you ready? He will stop the sacrifices. And she yes. will fulfill her promise. She is ready. We are ready. Amazing how people can start off as enemies and they can always change. I mean, granted, at the end, when you all want the same goal, I can see where that makes sense. But then again... Each life lost hangs over her. She feels them on her skin. Their voice is calling. And the ones who live their voices too. Their pain and guilt infect her. But she can't let them lead. She has to see the path herself clean and clear. And find the strength to follow it. Even as dead hands pull her back, she has to find the light within and hang it in the sky to guide the others. Sorry, I try not to talk during the dialogue, but then again, a lot of people are born into these types of things, so it's like they have no choice. It's like that's just what they know, so. But of course, people can always change, but that's just life in general, especially when it came to like these types of things like some civilizations where like you know one race has grown up a certain way and another race has grown up, but if they can somehow come like together it perfect. can change things it is cheerless <clears throat> in winter but the people are fed <clears throat> and housed and safe safe she knows why they're safe safe because of the blood what were you going to do when you reached it before you knew about the giants Kill my father. I came here to this stop him taking my people as slaves. I think I could have killed him. She went to make it all stop. But I didn't know everything then. What good would it do? I wonder now. Would killing him have changed it? <coughs> the darkness <coughs> runs deeper. The Bjork fear the giants. And you'll do anything the to be safe from things. them. They would keep murdering us. If I had killed your father. Someone else have taken his place and kept the blood yes, flowing. They all believe in love. We couldn't see any way to we be different. To show, him. show all of them. Show them how to fight the giants. But no. no it's different. It's, it's different. different. No. She can't trust him. Don't trust him. Don't. I mean, that's technically how life is now, too, but for more ridiculous reasons that I'm not going to really get into. <coughs> Wait, is this Jarnvider? What? He's scared. We shouldn't go through here. No. Why not? What is this place? Why? Those who enter here don't always come back. What does he mean? Well, we could go around it, or we would need to backtrack. And it would add a day or two to the journey. No. More than a day or two if we're dead. Of course, she's going to volunteer herself. This is the path we need to take. No, she's not listening to I'll us. lead you through. All she's right. so sure. How can you be so sure? Let's go. He is with you. Things <clears throat> will not follow him after you. Lead the way. She doesn't know what she's leading them into. You don't know what you're doing. Okay, now. What do you know about this place? This place is nothing special. There's something malevolent in the air. Something evil. Something you can't it? fight. Something he can't Spirits. Fight. <clears throat> the hidden folk. Nobody knows. The hidden folk will help us. Those that make it out. It could be something worse. They come back. 
changed. Changed? Changed how? What does that mean? Changed how? Fearful. Scattered. Like they left something behind. They left their souls behind. Don't lose your souls, Enoa. No. Alright. Just like any main character you play in some of these games, of course they volunteer or take the lead when they know shit's gonna go fucking can go fuck up at any time. It's darker. darker. Trees rising everywhere. Do you know what you're doing? She never knows. You don't know. You don't know what's in here. Where's the girl? Oh, she went that way. I've been here before. The night forest. A haunted place. You know what to do. There is no way through. We have to go back. Wait. You can find a path where they cannot. Look for it. Look. I can feel something watching us. Where? Don't be a bunch of punk bitches. You can't feel it. Why? <coughs> Here. Have a weapon to hand. Weapons will not help you here. Your sword is no good. Keep steady. Try not to jump at shadows. <sighs> what do you know of shadows? <laughs> we know. Yeah. All right, now let's see what kind of interesting stuff's going to happen. Is it going to be yes. puzzle solving Moving or actual around. combat? So I'm telling you that they're going to disappear and I'm going to end up somewhere Do else. What? Something is following what us. Hear? Just alongside. Listen. I think I can hear it. I don't like it. This place is not quiet. Not calm. Noises everywhere. Everywhere. Something deranged in the distance. <laughs> Smells like sandwiches. Unless that's uh, food that Crystal and Patrick got that I can smell coming from Patrick's room. I hear it again. She is terrified. Shh. Listen. Why can't I see it? Kind of all Wait, smells like PB and J there. sandwiches. Above us, what is that? Do you see it, Senor? I think it's a river you hear. Let's keep going. Astrid is scared. Why isn't Senwa? We passed this way before. This place is shifting. We're going in circles. Change is so confusing. Hmm. All right. This way's blocked. We'll have to find another. All right. So is this going to be one of those things where we have to do some backtracking, or is it like what they said? Since it's shifting, that's going to change up. Oh shit! They're gone. So now it's just me now. She didn't want to come here with you. You made her. <clears throat> now you have to find her. I can't find you. She's gone. Gone forever. She's dead because of you. Dead. Did they turn back or? Argus. He's gone too. They're all gone. You. Where are you? Them here. You them here. Now they don't are listen. lost. You brought them here to die. Don't listen to him. They followed you. I'm sure they'll Do turn up. To die alone. He will follow you. You brought them here to die. Anything up here? <clears throat> so there's no more lore to look for, so I might as well just go where I think might be the right way. And hope it's the right way. Alright. I think we just 
just go in a circle? We just did go in a circle. Alright, so this way it is then. They followed you. They trusted you. You shouldn't have. Come on. Don't doubt me. We're fine. Chick. Astrid is alive. She's safe. You have to help her. You called her. I'll stay there. Can't see you. Why can't she see you? Senua, is that you? She's terrified. So lost. I thought I'd lost you. I'm lost in the I'm here. Where are the others? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I turned around and you were all gone. She's what dead. is happening? <coughs> there are voices at the edge of hearing and uh -oh. movement all around. Figures. Uh oh. The I'm seeing shit. See them in the trees, but when I look again, there's nothing there. You can help them. You're about to get killed. Oh, never mind. Please, I see what isn't there. I love this will hurt you. Don't let it rule your mind. That's it. I can find things I can see. Yes. Things that bleed when struck with a spear. I am lost here. She's changed. I know how you feel. We know. Believe me. We understand. But we have to keep going. We understand. Stay strong, Astrid. I will get you through. Okay. That's uh interesting. People say this place burrows into your mind and finds <coughs> your fears, then torments you with them. I only half believed. She knows what it's like. You know what it's like. This place is pretty. Half takes me back into the woods. The face. I don't want to be alone here. Help her. Follow the river upstream. I'll find my way across to you, I promise. You have to. Can you make promises, Senua? Promises you can't keep. Can you keep All right. What if you never see her again? What if you never see this her This is only temporary part ways. Hopefully you are still alive when this is all said and done. Oh, there's the other dude. Who's there? The figure. Vagrim. Is it? Who is it? So dark now. Misty. Misty. Fog yeah. everywhere. It's him. Vagrima. Vagrima. <coughs> oh, now it smells like Senor. popcorn. I think that's what that is. Senor, is that you? Lost. Things <coughs> didn't have changed. There's a fog around me. Yes. Before my eyes. He can't you know see. Like. Beside my head. He has lost himself. He lost himself to the darkness. He can't stay here. Slipping away. I tried to have faith. You need more than faith. To keep them from falling apart. But there's something dark in this place. He sees it. Mm, through it. Rotten. And tainted. His own darkness. Help him. Help him. You are Fargrima. Wondrous mask. Yes, tell him. You can tell find him. his way anywhere. 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 Can see the light in anything. He saw the light in you. He saw it. And it grows dark now. And I cannot see the way. Help him. He helped you. I'm lost here. You were lost and he helped you. I know the sound of the river. I will find you. He is fading. You have to get him out of here. He is not strong enough. He doesn't have long. He always knows what to do. And now he's well, lost. Lost forever. Doubting. Makes no sense how my headset so randomly disconnects. <clears throat> this place did this to him. Them safe. Don't listen to him. See how they mill around. Lost lambs. So afraid. Blind. You could still save them. Alone. You'd do anything to keep them <laughs> safe, wouldn't you? This is your darkness speaking. 
Yes, and the darkness is always doubting us. But you can't save everyone, Senua. Maybe she can. Sometimes there are choices to be made. Which one are you going to save? What will you choose? Wait, I gotta make a choice? Ah, sh is this really? God damn it. I'm not sure who Brian chose when he played, but... I mean, this dude kind of been helping us out, and this chick we just barely met. Ah, fuck it. Senor, I'm here. Him. We have to find the others. Come with me. Why? Yes. Unless it all leads to the same thing, we'll see. You gonna follow me or what? Okay, I'll say you just gonna stand there. <clears throat> no, find them. Focus. All right. I'm sure she'll be fine. There she is right there, see? Demons she cannot fight. Who's there? Don't come any closer. I'll sit her. There. It's me. So lost. Help her. Sonoa? Sonoa, I thought I'd lost you. I I looked for so long. I thought you'd left me behind. I wouldn't do that. Come on, let's go. Stay close. All right, two out of the three from the missing party have been found. This dog is the... <clears throat> I thought I saw him. He was following me, sword drawn. That wasn't him. It's just a figment of your imagination. Augusta, where is he? Augusta. There he is. He's changed different now. His eyes are red. Has he been crying? Something has happened here. What's happened? What happened to you? Something terrible. I think I saw. What did he see? Something changed him. Something I had to do. What was it? What, what did he have to do? I didn't want to do it. He forced my hand. Who? Something terrible. Who? A vision. No. It's nothing. Tricks. Is it real? Oh, nothing is ever nothing. Let's leave this place. Get out, get Demons. out now. His past haunts him. Get them out of here. Yes, get them out of here. Alright, now the whole party's back together. Up here. Let's see if we get them the fuck out of here. She oh. lost them. Drown them in their fears. Let the forest lay them bare and scour their minds. She knows that deep excoriation. The fear you fear you will not see the end of. And yet, they made it through. She found them. They are safe. Safe to keep on walking. Fight her corner. Share the weight. But who has changed and who is not? Do they look at her in doubt? They follow still. No blame. Those striking out in hate. But their minds are shut it tight and closed off to her eyes. What did Thorgester see so dark he cannot speak? And Astrida, her primal pain. Feel like that will shake you. The wanderer, always so sure, has a certainty been lost. There's no time now to question or look back. A choice is made. Hmm. I'm interested what kind of music got temp got cut out since I have this set to streamer mode. I actually thought that was kind of cool that they had a streamer mode option in the uh, options for uh, copyrighted music for people who want to stream. So that's really cool that they did that. So I was interested what kind of music there is. Maybe I'll replay this at a later time. 
when I'm not streaming to see what kind of music was cut out, if there even is a difference, or if it's just altered to like non-copyrighted type music. Smoke in the distance. Is there a war or is that like a call for help? <coughs> We're not far now. We can see it from here. There. Borgavarki. Fast forward. she followed have led her here finally so close to the heart of darkness the root of the fetid flower whose stench she tracked across the sea a fortress she must break not with sword and spear but open eyes and strength of will Are those all the sacrifices? They're still alive. You can feel it. How could they? Suffering. Look. They are for the giant sacrifices. Monsters. Monsters. How can they? What is that? Make it stop, Senua. That is. You have to. Where we sacrifice the offerings. Monster. People. Thorgestir. Yes. People. It's where you sacrifice people. People. It's where you tie them up and watch them die. Slowly release them. We have to rescue them. I'll go inside. I'll tell my father and he will cut them down. Light is fading fast. Can't just leave them. They're suffering. You can't. You can't. I'll stay there. Fagrima, can you please cut them down? So much suffering. Who's going in? The Ark know you. And I'll stay there. And I don't like you. <sighs> I don't want to start anything before I've spoken to my father. I don't know yet, Sanwa. Okay. Just me and focus to them. Hmm. Tell him. They will help them. Rescue the people and keep them safe. We will. Yes. Yeah. We'll come back. But wait. <laughs> until we are inside. Come on. Come. Are you really going to just walk in? They will kill her for sure. She has to. Thorgester will tell them. So are we walking into a trap where Storgus are really going to be on our side? Look what her father did. They are not their fathers. She is different. We are different. He is different too. Hmm. I just got some kind of achievement. She's come so far. Funny how it didn't pop up on my computer, just on my Xbox app. And found another. All the blood, all the fire. Everything she's seen carried on a hidden tie. This is the end, the point where light vanishes, and yet it is a pale and quiet place. Hush. Can this be the place she fought so hard to find? Oh. Finally getting to see the people that you purposely let enslave you to try and free Something your own people. Something's not right. He is frightened. You're worried. I wasn't supposed to come back empty-handed. He'd have dragged you here in chains, and But all's well. He'll forget about that when he hears what we have to tell him. But has he changed? I don't trust anything he's saying. He wants to change, does he? They've spotted us. Will they want to chain me up again? I won't let that happen. Really? Yeah, we'll Maybe see. Maybe Briag will turn on him. Who are you? And then what will you do? It's me! Thorgesto! Who is he with? Them or you? Trust me. However it might seem. There's no turning back now. I'm with you. It's what he wants to believe, but is it the truth? It's up and so on. Thorgesto! Is he strong enough? Gods. I thought you were dead. Me? Dead? <laughs> I would 
should see you dead first often. He plays that game. <laughs> he talks that talk. It is good to see you, my friend. She's with me. The others. You're safe with him. He is welcomed here. We're returning hmm. from here. Stay close. Three days of clear sky. Maybe you trust him. But do you trust the, the others? Who knows if they will listen to him? All she has lost, and all she has to lose, they hear. All the names she carries on her heart, she remembers. This is the last sign. His father's influence is strong. Your father's influence was strong. But he is not his father. You are not your father. You know what it's like. Show him the way. There is nothing you can do. Even if he wants to have changed, is it possible? You can help him. Too bad you but can't can hear their himself. conversation because the voice is you in the narration, the but I'm guessing that do. was intended. There's no turning back now. But are you really ready to <clears throat> meet this kind of evil? This kind of monster purpose? Are you ready, Samantha? She has to be. To join Circles us. round and red, a bloody barrier against the night, a wall to shield you from the savagery. But the true darkness is inside. Not out. It always is. You know what's coming. His father. The one who clouds her oh, mind. Okay, is never mind. Here. I thought it was a. Uh... Some things don't change. There's always one who will seize the reins, see the field of pain and reap it. Ripe blood and bitter tears. Her father. His father. Look Hello, Faja. Sitting there on his throne, worshipping himself. Orgester, my boy, you've returned. The goody. It makes my skin crawl. This isn't going to work. When we did not hear from you, I fear the worst. He does not care for his. How was your raid? Where are the slaves you brought? Dead, all the lost you hear this storm dead. coming into what? I'm sorry. Something more important. Let's see if this man can listen. Oh, I doubt it. Something important, you say? A souvenir from your travels. He calls us a Father, listen. You. The giants. They can be killed. I can kill them. We can kill them. This woman, Senua, she knows how. He won't believe you. Give him a chance. Look in his eyes. <laughs> Show him who you are. A souvenir that kills giants. He doubts. The giants cannot be killed. No more than God can. Him. I've seen it with my own eyes. I've seen two giants torn to stone. He doesn't believe. I can kill them. And I could kill you. We could kill you. This is nonsense, Thorgester. I'm dangerously close to Gothgau. You should kill him. You cannot defy the giants. I alone know how to keep them at bay. Do not turn your back on me. You must. He must. He has caused you so much You are a power. simpleton. He needs the giants to give him power. He uses the giants to control people. Forrester. Make Forrester understand. He needs to understand. There will be no swaying him. I have no men like him. This must be the only voice. This is his chance to change. I will convince him. No, he is weak. He wants to fight. He just needs to believe it is possible. He loves his father. Thargus. She <coughs> is a liar. You could never have trusted him. And you an idiot. Summer. This is some trick to overthrow us and destroy all we have been. Stay close. No. You will watch beside me tonight as the giant takes his tribute. <coughs> Get out. See how indomitable. How terrifying it there is. There will be no tribute. 
See how there is no chance in hell you could Fantastic. defeat it. We have defeated them. And see how I turn it aside. How I control it through my sacrifice. She has nothing now. How it leaves us in peace. Peace for who? We will kill her, destroy her. See how I have saved my people. We never have come here. There are no people waiting down there. What will happen it's when he finds out? It's nearly time. Follow me. They'll get to stop him. Stop. Why doesn't he do something? He was with you. He said he was with us. The sacrifices Lost. are gone. Free. There's no one there. No. The giant. It's gone. And this is where we get to prove ourselves. Ow. So I take it we're going to be the sacrifice now, I assume. Tyrant? Alright, so I guess we're gonna have to fight. You are smarter than him. Use your rage. So unfortunately we're gonna have to kill some of Thorgister's people just to get to prove our point. Really? There we go. How can they see with that fucking mesh on their face? What the fuck? He did like the God damn it, get up. He was weak. I don't know. He didn't try to stop them. I knew we couldn't trust him. Yes, she is Where's right. The we kill him. Now, Let's wait. End this. Senua, we need to kill <laughs> the giant right here, right now, in front of the Bjork. Show them the truth, just like you showed Torkester. They'll never learn. All they understand is death. We need to end this so we can be free. She is right. Again. Kill the Gordit. To do so, what? Senua? Fagram. I don't know. She can't. She doesn't know his name. Thorgesta. Come on. I mean, I don't doubt that they deserve it. To lure you in and then kill us. Kill us. Don't be stupid. Alright. So now we gotta probably be do careful. like a little mini quest. Some kind of trick. She is not listening again. She mm -hmm. just Let's figure out do? this thing's name. We told him already. I don't know its name. I don't understand. We cannot fight him yet. I can't fight it yet. I need time. Speed is the name yep, something's going on in the distance. You can see what he could become, but others don't. She sees the warrior fighting. 
You have to stop this. Thor is still calling us, so there's probably still some kind of hope. System and this is so fucked up. Oh, never mind. Really? I still dodge and they hit me. That the combat system in this game is a lot fucking worse than the first one. The first one was a lot more simple, it made more sense. I like this. Oh, you dodge and you still fucking get hurt. Then how does that make sense? Just like that. How the fuck does that make sense? Really? Comment with for this box. Yeah, you stay back and cower. Are you going to let him kill you? Come. <laughs> but I don't wanna. She's killing all of us. I don't wanna be next. Really? God damn it, stop on the tax already! And then this a-hole comes in with the cheap shot. Another day of peace and safety. Kick him in the punch him in the ball. You hear that woman? Hear him coming? The most glorious of them all. The tyrant. The king. We have an understanding here. Unspoken connection. I give him blood, and he gives me power. Question me! 
So now we're probably gonna do a little mini game to figure out this guy's name. When oh, never mind. Fire Story. spilled from the mountain and the ash blotted out the sun. It wasn't the end. Story time to learn about the giant. starved and suffered. Homes were destroyed and leaders fell. Now we're just... The ties of friendship loosened and each one fought for their own. Sea of chaos, one rock stood firm. He said, I know what to do. Follow me, and I will save you. He meant it, wanted to keep them safe. His people. Fear made the people turn to him. They trusted him, obeyed him, raised him above the others. Their fear made him strong. Hmm. So what? This guy grew arrogant and started to miss uh, treating his people. After they started following him. And as the land healed and the people healed, their fear held. And he saw them start to turn away, to think for themselves, to choose their own path. And he felt his own strength ebb in turn. Oh, so what? He didn't want his people to be free thinkers or something? Place in their hearts, their wills. So he made the giants, brought them forth from the shaking earth, the roaring sea. Blinding snow brought them into being, and the people who trusted him and obeyed him, they saw them too, and saw they had more to fear. <clears throat> Yeah. <laughs> 
Enter. Yeah, I'm getting close to a five hour stream. <laughs> Thorgister and his dad. He really let his own father best him in a fight. All Thorgestor wanted was for everything to be over. I'm going to kill him. We will kill him. There's always someone ready to take his place. You told me that yourself. <clears throat> Might have been me. If I had never met you. You have to show them a different way. You have to redeem them. How do I stop this? You came to stop the sacrifices. Kill the giant. His father, father. The tyrant. My father's name. One name. Is only fear. You will end this. Now we gotta fight this guy. You killed your son, you son of a bitch! I didn't do shit! Give me an op. Get in. Let me uh, dodge. What the hell? This guy got powers too, or something? Again, like I said, this combat says I'm so fucking stupid, I'm fucking hitting dodge, and yet I'm still getting hit. Make no goddamn sense. Make it make sense, goddammit.
Again, dot did a double dodge and still get hit. No, I will shine a light on your lies, and they will see the truth. There are no giants. It's just you. So what, is this a part two of this fight? Kill him! You can see he's weakening. Kick his ass! Beat the fuck out of him! And you will want to hold on to that strength no matter what. Break his arm! Smash his head on a rock! Oh, come on, don't hold back! She can't do it. I choose how to end this. All the questions answered. Truth burning bright <clears throat> to scour away the darkness. Shadows of horror and hate writ large on the sky. Phantoms made from fear. <clears throat> darkness outside mix. Darkness inside. She sees it. But the darkness is inside her too. Because she loves, even after everything. She loves. And if she loves, what will she do to save that love? To keep that promise? All the lost ones, when they find her, what will she do to protect them? All those names, all those lives. What will she do to hold them? Wisdom has a price. She is her mother's child. But she is also her father's. I see it now. The darkness is inside me. It is his darkness, not hers. Your darkness. And it carves a path for me. In your blood, in your bones. But I can't 
see where it leads. Haunting you forever. Part of me wants to let go of the fear. Let go of my shadows. I choose my way. What will we become? We are not our fathers. There is always a choice. You taught me that. We will choose. Together. You decide. All her life she has been alone. She chose it. A shield to keep her heart from harm. A hymn to still the other voices, the ones outside. Not anymore. The ones she saved, the names she found, they lift her up. Their hands reach out to hers. And now, she reaches back to them. A story is not written. There is always a choice. A lot of fucking dialogue. Wait, wait, well, hold on. So... Is that it? So does that mean that there's going to be another one, or... Is the game not over yet, and the credit is just... We just gotta roll through the credits and see what happens next. Assuming if anyone can hear me. Because now it just went silent all of a sudden. Okay, so maybe... Okay, okay, maybe that's why it's silent. I just wanted to make sure my headset didn't cut off. I'm guessing it's silent because I have it on... Streamer mode so whatever copyrighted music i guess they had intended for the credits is probably muted out <clears throat> so i guess we will um wait hold on oh scott's in that too so i guess we'll wait and find out see if there's anything uh, it says exit to main menu so i mean we'll let the credits roll see what happens but if that's really how it ends that kind of sucks But unless there is some stuff that I missed that to get a different ending, does this game have multiple endings? So that's what I'm curious to know. Let me see something. While that's going in the background, let me do a Google search. Okay, so according to Google, it only has one ending, so I'm assuming that this is being left open for, I'm assuming this is being left open for a, a third Hellblade game, unless, 
unless this is how they choose to end it, where it's like you just got to use your imagination with how she and puts puts an end to all this between with the giants and all this other kind of stuff. Oh, is Jeremy streaming now? Uh, new narrators unlocked. You have completed the main story. Senya's companions are now unlocked as narrators. Choose the others in the new story or in the pause menu after starting a new game. All right. So I guess that is it. So that is Hellblade 2. So didn't end how I was expecting it to end. I was actually thinking of some kind of big traumatic finish, but it is what it is. So if you've been... If you've been with me the entire stream, I greatly appreciate it. And if you're new to the stream, please give me a follow. Or please consider giving me a follow. And if you're watching this on YouTube and if you made it all the way to the end, please consider liking this video if you liked it. Um, subscribe so you can stay up to date. And make sure you hit that notification button for whenever I upload a new video. Until then, I will see you all in the next one. Take care of yourselves.